can't tell me that this is not this. This is what it looks like. Uh, my gym teacher got fired for adding a zesty breakfast burrito to the obstacle course. What? I didn't know we could play as mutants. <laughs> the five stages of grief. Denial, anger, bargaining, the when... tiny shred of evidence that got us real and acceptance. When you find out what she's playing, you're gonna be more bad. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, well, I, I can't be mad at Rebecca. I can. No, it's extremely funny. You're gonna be mad that it's that funny. I'm already mad. Alright. Rebecca, you're grounded. Hello, everyone. Oh. And Again? welcome <laughs> to Tomb of Evaluation Nuzlocke session number four. Uh, yeah. We've got plenty of people. Who, let me let me roll my die to determine who's gonna say it. It's better than just waiting for someone to pop up. Because... I'm never gonna say anything if you pick me. So... I'm keeping notes now. I just I figured out why Fluffy's not here. You just don't want to ask me because I would not be able. To. You just forgot that Fluffy's not here. No, no, no. Fluffy's not here because Fluffy always gets rolled on these yeah. things. Oh. Yeah. One, Roll two, his number three, anyway. Four. Man, what happened last time? I have mush brain. Uh, I'd like to double it and pass it on. Oh, oh pass it on. Okay. Sure, there's one event you can. No, no, hold on, let it cook. <laughs> Alright, she's double it. I'm, I'm genuinely mush brain, I can't remember anything. He is not the person to ask. She's doubling and passing it along. Well, uh, one, two, three, four. Dimitri, what happened? Okay, so. Happened was, uh... I'd like to bring in the WWE briefcase and take this uh, event from him. <laughs> Go for the power driver. Yeah. I'm yeah, I want to. I want to fight for the championship belt. I bought the briefcase and now I have to speak. Okay. No, no. Okay. <laughs> it's my turn. Quite rude. Uh, what happened was, um, we were traversing throughout the uh, throughout the tunnel. Uh, came across a giant. After, you know, defeating many a creature, uh, uh, the giant was lost, and uh, Ink Drop used their magical powers of being telepathic and saying it was the spirit of the forest who guarded them back. Um, afterwards, uh, we were resting, and then when we woke up, Milton saw this big giant lizard thing and was like, I'm gonna go kill it and eat it. And then proceeded to wake everybody up. And then someone, totally not Nessie, screamed and alerted it to its alerted everyone to its presence. And uh, Milton got eaten by hubris and died. Uh, big whoop. And then we left. And then we. Uh, what? Did we fight Grungs? I think we fought frogs. You did fight did frogs. Fight yeah, and I think we ended up the fighting frog, and we got a level. You did. He leveled up to level four. Everything that happened is there. You get your point of inspiration. Uh, but now, because she double and pass along, I think I've just got negative inspiration to throw out at one point against you the party. Me. <laughs> nice. You know you want to throw it at me. I'll throw it at whoever I damn well please. Nah, you like targeting me. Uh, but yeah, we are Sans of Fluffy today. We have uh, someone Jaegering him during combat. Uh, Jaeger and Plum. Uh, and the stream is nicely hiding who Rebecca will be playing. Uh, as she is still Milton on her talkie. But yeah. Uh, the party has decided to make their way towards Camp Righteous. They're going to go follow the river Tirik. Uh, and then head across was their current plan, I believe. So... Yeah. Let's get to it. Uh, who is going to lead the day? I guess technically since we haven't had any, um... Interruptions since last, just keep it on. Um, we'll cheat, we'll cheat AJ, the care of it. Show all the uh, stuff. I'm on GM. That's fair enough. Maybe well, a little, yes. Yo, quick, I want to log in to view all the information. 
<laughs> you had a table and images of maps I put in, so we didn't have to use Yo. the same battle map. <laughs> there was nothing spoilerish on this table. Ah, <laughs> uh, it spoils the map names. It does. Mm, you okay. playing them like three years ago spoils the map names. <laughs> Since when did I play them? <laughs> Lyria. I just stole them oh, from nice. Lyria. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I assume uh, if there are no changes, so I assume like Pochi will be the one to do the main one. We shall grant Mochi powers of observation. There's a lot of dice rolls, I don't like it, I'm scared. Never fear the dice roll. Now the d4, and that makes me even more scared. <laughs> uh, it is, seems to be quite a cold day, as opposed to it being like swelteringly hot, it's like a pretty mild. 26 degrees Celsius day. Um, Jesus Christ. And it is pouring. This temperature is about as consistent as WA. You know what? Let me it's, just check my uh, druid. We're in the rainforest. That's cold for a rainforest. <laughs> what does the weather radar say for the next 24 hours, DM? What, what I just said. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> No, no okay. wind, heavy rain, uh, colder than usual weather. At the end of the day. <laughs> Yo, it's gonna rain, my guy. <laughs> You're right. I should be doing this before. It's like post. Right? Yeah, you idiot. You did. Why? Cause. Cool. It's funny. All right. You're leading now. I'm gonna right. do my roll. Everyone, right. roll their uh, their travel check. The civil. Right, weapon mastery. I'm gonna forget about this. Oh right, weapon mastery. Oh, perhaps that was meant to be in my uh, never mind. This is the first time I actually used weapon mastery, so I have no clue how it does. Forgot to roll that in the tower. Do you want me to uh, just oh, leave it, re-roll it's, it? It's all it doesn't good. matter. Dimitri did the same thing. It's alright, Dimitri can't follow orders either. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? I just did. No. <laughs> and it is like you still want the one that you roll. <laughs> Rebecca, roll on as well, just to influence them, even though you're not there. We won't even see the numbers, we won't even know uh, what the positives or negatives are. Yeah, into the tower. Am I rolling this? Yeah, yeah into the tower. Like everyone should have done. Don't show us your positives. <laughs> okay. Look, I'm a bit rusty. <laughs> it's alright. I'm fucking tired, <laughs> and if God it. didn't want us to enjoy Tom Cruise, he wouldn't have given us pictures of boobs. What? what? I'm gonna uh, roll survival now. Ten? Yeah, uh, let me... Oh. It's out of the table. Where are you going to roll? Yeah, sorry, my bad. I also <laughs> can't follow instructions. Let me do that again. Uh, <laughs> I think it's because we were we'll, playing. We'll keep... We were playing today. Okay, nah. we can forget it for the day. No, what, no. Wasn't yours meant to be in the open? No, yeah, but you forgot to add yeah. the bonus and I forgot to ask if it was going <laughs> slow uh, or fast to get the penalties. We're going medium. We're going medium. Alright, okay, so it's a 23. <laughs> Uh, plus one, minus one, Yo. plus Yo. one, minus Yo. one, minus Yo. one, <laughs> plus two. <laughs> so Have plus we one. ever gotten more it's than a, plus one? It's a 24. <laughs> Let's go. Have oh, we, no, no, it's Have we ever zero. gotten it more than a... plus one to the point where this actually makes sense to no, me? No, plus one, yeah, 24. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, so you uh, can go in the direction you want to go. Alright. Yeah. Holy shit. Uh, we're just we heading going... straight to the center, I think, at this point, right? I think the best course of action is like go bottom left, so we can go on the diagonal to meet up on the river. Yeah, because we wanted to go. Yeah, oh, we wanted to go to Camp Righteous. Uh, hang on. Let me check my notes that I'm actually. Taking. We did want to go to Camp Righteous, but I didn't know if we wanted to keep going straight down and then start going left, or if we wanted to whatever. Well, it seems like following the the river, I don't think gives us any bonuses. <laughs> to not fuck it, it up, so... It doesn't give us any bonuses, but it means we don't have to use... Use what? Like, water for rations. It's raining all day. It is raining all day. It's a great time to start turning. Yeah, you got a point. Yeah, we can do that. How many times can we move by, like, doing, um, medium? One. One. Yes. Got no preference. We move on the sense. diagonal. Okay. Just need to... Plus the Oath of Survival Paladin. I already do. Oh, you're actually survival? Neat. Yeah. 
Don't trust the plant knight because I don't know anything apparently. We probably shouldn't trust anyone that's an animal in this part. Oh, or a plant. You know, you got a point. I was about to say trust the lady who missed the blood, but never mind. I'm out of the picture now. What? Because you said don't mess with animals. You're an animal? Oh, right. <laughs> okay, but you at least have a human form. <laughs> I still have ears and a tail, though. She, she look... has more of an animal form than I do. You're yeah. more human than me and Plum. <laughs> yeah, we're probably the most human, to be fair. Mm -hmm. Through circumstance. I'm human. After all? Who the fuck said that? <laughs> no one? As, um, yeah, as you're walking through the day, it seems to go relatively fine. Um, What's the day, sorry? The day? Uh, the date is... Milton's uh, 7th of Elise? I believe this is the 7th, yeah. Yo, it's 7th of Earth Day. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, yeah, so this is day 7. Yeah. You're going on the diagonal. Yeah. Uh, the morning is fine. As you all just walk across the trees, as the mulch and the dirt and the mud uh, all start to like just slosh in your things, you all got your rain catches out to catch as much water as you can. Um, mm. Eventually, you all stop for a midday break, and that goes relatively smoothly as well. You find a place that's not hit as hard by the rain, but it's not like a cave or anything. It's just a particularly dry patch of land where the forest is a lot denser than it is usually um, and as you continue on towards the night um, as you all move probably around 5 or 6 p.m. Uh, you all hear um, a rustling coming from above you Oh God. Is this like as we're setting up or like as it's starting to get? As you're probably considering about stopping. Okay, yeah. It's like in a couple hours or so. I think my first reaction upon like just the twitch of the ear from hearing that is just to draw a weapon straight up. Just yeah. to be and careful. Like if you're not paranoid if you're right. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, Sam. I, may I perception? Yeah. So we. Well, it's the last part. Looks edible. Much well, we don't know yet. As you look around in the air, uh, look around, you can't see anything. <laughs> um, you just hear the rustling of above you as everyone seems to have stopped, gazed upwards as they're looking around and seeing trees move as if like uh, a numerous amount of animals are. Uh, currently swinging from vine to vine on top of the trees and not getting a glimpse at any of them. Hmm. Do they like seem like shape-wise like in a blur like medium or? You can't tell. You can you no? can hear the noises. You can tell us something's see. up there. Um, without an active perception, you don't know what's going on. I will make an active perception. <laughs> nice! You notice a small blur um, circling the party. Circling, okay. Yeah. yeah, immediately bring attention to the fact that it is circling around and just caution everyone to be as on guard as possible. I'm gonna... Drop a divine mm. sense. If this is pointed out, AJ, mm -hmm. could I cast Grease in the path? Yeah, if you want. <laughs> in the path, it, like, try and predict, you know? Yeah. As I cast Grease. <laughs> yeah, you <laughs> Grease up all the leaves above you uh, so that they're slippery. Um, let me just do another roll. Yep, let me know if um, I'm gonna regret this. <laughs> don't worry, if anything bad happens, we set on fire. Well... Uh, you, 
You see, as uh, as you look up, as you're watching Yvonne, you notice that they are it's still like circling in, and as it does, even though the the things are gre- greased, you can see as it begins to like slip on one of the leaves. It seems to like grab it with um, ferocity, as if it's like not gonna oh. let it, and then it just keeps thinking like it's crunching the leaves as it's doing now <laughs> uh, to keep upright to get rid of all the grease slipping its hands away. Um, as the circle begins to get smaller and smaller. Uh, good attempt, but it seems to be actively furious now. Uh, C- can we just move out from under it? I want to cast Entangle in the area ahead of it to make it extremely difficult for it to move. Okay. See if I can catch it. I want to try to catch it on it if I if it's possible to try like like wrap it up. Alright, uh... What is... Hey, is, is that a short rest? No, it's okay. Like a... Yeah, you shoot out and entangle. Uh, what's this? If it this? needs to make a save, save, it is DC uh, 13 strength. Okay. It might succeed if it's very strong with that, but chance. Uh, as you start throwing up the the vines of entangle it seems to like go around the trees and instead of like being tangled up you've just seem to have given it more handholds as you've made extra vines for it to swing on <laughs> mm. immediately they see like they just move straight past us and just drop it yep. like straight up uh, after i see all this i would also like to contribute if i'm allowed yeah, go ahead. Web. Uh, your, I cast web. <laughs> your divine sense does not trigger anything, I believe. Um, and I yeah, believe. Your, your web is also a strength-based thing, or is it dex? Uh, just throw different checks at it. It has to fail one of them. Uh, I will also with the spell because I keep Let's make a forgetting. Dexterity saving throw. Okay. To not get stuck, and then I think it's. No, it's just, it's just dex. Okay. Since I keep forgetting as well, when I cast a spell, I'm giving, um, uh, fortify to yep. myself. Uh, this is 15, by the way. Um, suddenly a bolt as, um, as it seems to dive down, uh, directly at Plum. Plum looks up, like, bewildered, and then the web just seems to cover the area right above Plum as it's like five feet away from oh. Plum. Uh, you see this little creature wrapped up uh, in web, struggling, flailing in the air as it's <laughs> forward to grab onto Plum. Um, can I have everyone sure. make a history check? Is this something that's going to be a disadvantage? Hmm? Is this one that would be disadvantage or no? Uh, f- probably not. Not? Okay. Interesting. My rolls sure. today. Jesus. Eleven. Um, We're great historians. Nessie, Yvonne, Plum, and Mochi. Uh, you've been around the block a while. You know of some of the great legends of this world. Um, what seems to be captured in this thing seems to be like a small puppet of Dritz, the Drow Adventurer. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I, I like to imagine that my understanding of the character is purely from like the paladins I would have ran into on the way to hmm. uh, Baldur's Gate. Just out of name alone. So I see that I'm just like squint as like, is this actually? And then just like the puppet was like, what? <laughs> It's just, she's just a bit bewildered. <laughs> yeah, especially with that knowledge, at least Nessie in this case. Um, as you get a look, it's like... You know it's supposed to be modelled after Dritz, but it's not like 100% accurate. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay... Yeah, and it continues just to, to flail in the air, uh, don't you? <laughs> a puppet, you said. Or like a... Uh... What'd you say? Yeah, like a like a soft plush. Marketable plushie. Oh and it's moving. God. My yeah. first thing is I turn, I turn to Cinder, probably. Just like, 
it's, it's a plush that's moving around, and I just want to see her expression first. She is just in awe. She okay. looks like she wants to grab it and put it in her bag. Okay, so that's not hers. That's the that's the first box ticked. <laughs> My second box is to like lightly hook it. <laughs> Uh, as as an amendment, just for extra coming, while it's uh, flailing around, it is also loudly yelling at you to yeah. let it go and oh. cursing. I still poke it. <laughs> uh, like what? While it's if you poke it, like it's while it's flailing, it like tries and, like flails in your direction to like try and hit you. Oh, like, wait, let me out. Uh. Okay. Conversation. Care to explain what your plan was? The panther over there! I want the panther! I, I turn to where you're pointing. <laughs> and she's gonna be pointing directly down at Plum, who directly points down. It's like, there's a panther?! I'm just gonna make a quick little one more history check. Uh... Ten, ten is an average roll with a zero. Uh, I look at Plum and go like, ah, uh, for a moment, and then I just sort of look back, realize what this thing's mimicking, and like, ah. Uh... And then look back to Plum. Is Plum even the right color? No, Plum's no. white. Yeah. Plum turns exactly. around. <laughs> Plum's turned around thinking that there's a panther behind him. Yeah. Uh, you mean, you mean that one? Points to Plum. He's he's still wildly fa flailing and like not looking in your direction. Uh, I just at this point like we'll put like the way the okay just like a bit more guard guards down. Uh, I'll take out a dagger and then just like a little bump at the uh, the back end of it just to get its attention, not to hurt, just to get its attention. Like, hey, <laughs> was that you trying to go after that person? Like Alright, yeah. <laughs> yeah. What, what do you want? You coming to mock me? Ah uh, ha ha! Laugh at the little puppet man. It's all tied up. I'm also wondering what you're doing and who you're going to hurt. Because if you hurt someone, we might have a problem. No, no, I don't want to hurt it. I want it. They're a person. Humanoid. <laughs> like st stops, <laughs> looks over at Plum, it like clicks and he's like, Ah, oh, God fucking damn it! Uh huh. I, I, uh, I, 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 I'm, I'm sorry. I, I, I think Yvonne uh, is bewildered just by a puppet speaking. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, I miss my It's not exactly a, a puppet. It's more like um, like it's made of cloth, not like yeah, wood. still, yeah. it's a similar thing. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Different material. <laughs> Are they still hanging up in the web? Sorry. Uh, I have not released. It. Yeah, if it hasn't been released. <laughs> cool. Can I throw the boomerang? <laughs> if you want. I want to cut the web while they're up there still. Keep. Oh. God damn. We don't need to try to cut the web. I want to cut through the bit of the web above with the boomerang. Ah. <laughs> so you cut the web. Uh, the this this figure just drops onto the mud. How tall <laughs> is this figure? Two three, right? That's what we. Uh, something no, I think small. For flat two. Yeah, flat two. Okay. Like, like small. <laughs> Before I has a chance to like More run or do anything, before I has a chance to run or do anything, I just want to like just sort of put uh, my boot over just to keep him pinned down, <laughs> <laughs> just to like wait, just to see. Like, still not entirely convinced right. that the thing's fine. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Yeah, just please let me go. Inside check. I'm sorry. I <laughs> Go ahead, <laughs> roll, roll it, sir. I promise I won't, I won't hurt you or any of your friends. Ten. What does a ten do, Rebecca? 
I mean, probably, you probably ha nothing you... really. It's a fucking plush. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah, it's hard. Like, obviously, you can't um, like discern, you know, through like, you know, eyes or like, you know, really like um, mouth movements or like facial expressions. Does it have much expression at all? It's calmed down. I think, yeah, he would. Mystery okay. character. Roll me an int. <laughs> yeah, like, it's like, yeah, his face can still, like, move and stuff. But you just, like, you know, you can't pick up on subtleties the way you could, like, a, you know, human flesh yeah, face. Exactly. Uh, you're getting int. Yeah, because it's just like, like the eyes w wouldn't, you know, like, change as much. But, mm -hmm. you know, just like the kind of like cloth around it, you know, changes shape, to, you know, to a bit of like eyelids and eyebrows. Yeah. He has uh, cut down, he's not thrashing about anymore. Yeah. I'll let, I'll let Sam get his int check in there, just real quick. Because hmm? you're like trying to like mind link with all that? Yes. So, yes. And I assume that uh, they're probably uh... going to be resisting. Yes. <laughs> Um, so Something. is it a save or just a check? No, just a flat check. Just flat check. Okay. Um, where is that? Stop resisting. Yo, are you yo, <laughs> are you holding this current person? Kinda. Like it's like more so if I got my okay. foot over, press a little bit of pressure, but not enough to like hurt her. Okay. Yeah, yeah, no, I don't get into that. So I just reconnect to uh, Evone in this case. Uh, as you as you like push into it. Uh, you hear from behind just some, like, random action sword-swinging sound. What the fuck? A turn? <laughs> from behind? Yeah, I No, turn. yeah, like, wait, wait, no, from the behind here. Oh! Okay. <laughs> I think in that confusion I just, like, lift off a bit, just, like, unsure what the fuck that was. Like probably enough for you to like escape from it. <laughs> like Avon is just yeah. unsure like what to do because it is that it is that moment of like she doesn't really understand what this is, what it's doing, or if it's a proper she doesn't consider it a threat. But she's just oh, on guard. Yeah, I would I uh, make it to try and get out. You can it's, get just out. A, it's just a check, isn't it? Or is it a, no? Am I able to? Oh, am I able to just? Is it like we yeah. where I can just pull it apart? Yeah, now? it's it's that sort of okay, moment yeah, of like hesitation <laughs> for that that you can get out. He's just on guard. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah. Then yeah, he'll just like yeah, pull it apart and like shake it off. If I'm, are you adopting the midget? Can't say that nowadays. <laughs> <laughs> we call them halflings. <laughs> uh, I guess in the uh, I can uh, respond mentally, right? I keep forgetting that yes. part. Okay, yeah. Um, I guess the mental response is no. Full stop. <laughs> just like just complete. Just no. Full <laughs> stop. Just, just I no. Think it's getting out. I know. Just keep this thing's about to attack us, so just be aware. Nice. Yes. Pulls out knuckle axe. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Beat it up. Yeah, and just watches just to see what it says, what it does. Like, Avon's taking guard. She's not taking action. What is it? Did... Um, uh, Ink Drop pull out a weapon? Well, Ink Drop's a little bit away, but they've already thrown a weapon at you before yeah. the boomerang. Uh, yeah, I probably wouldn't have known where that came from. Yeah, it's fine. But, yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I probably would have just been focusing on a bone. I mean, you could probably see them. They are standing there with a knuckle axe in one arm, hand and a boomerang in the oh, other. Oh, okay, yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, probably, probably just, just like, hey, you, you want a tussle? <sighs> now, I don't want to fight you because your friend let me go, but if, if I have to, I will. 
What are they? Hmm. You know what? I want to do <laughs> a perception. I want to know if they look like they're made of any material that could be used to light a candle. Oh my god. Absolutely. Wait, hang on. Like, if you could light him with a candle, or if you could, he could light a candle. If any part of you looks like a candle wick, I guess. Um, possibly his hair. As I it's attempt, like as I cast um, white, through a craft it's like white you. ropey. Oh no! <laughs> I I uh, <laughs> it's a very weird way to use it. I'm just like I'm looking at it like you instantly light or snuff out a candle torch or small candle. <laughs> so I attempt to druid craft your hair. As a wick, mm -hmm. he instantly light a, light, light a, like a candle. Knowing right. full well it's raining, but yeah. But he is also made of cloth. It's like. Phew, phew. All new turn for man of the cloth. Mm. I mean, the DM didn't say no. <laughs> so. <laughs> is the DM there? Yeah, I'm here. You, okay, you, is, you, are you well? You ignite, but again, it's right. <laughs> like, it's pretty much gone immediately. <laughs> you can probably feel it still, but. Yeah. But he's still. Alright, don't do that again, mister! Or miss, it. sorry. <clears throat> Makes wind blow through your ear. And just gives Ooh. you this look of... Eh. Okay. Uh, I... I think at this point, like, just turn to Mochi and just... Can just, kind I of get that, like, sort of shoulder shrug of, like, I don't know what to do? <laughs> Like, you're going to watch them very carefully and then go to bed. We just okay. Is that smart? Probably not, but it's the choice I'm making anyway. For my main source of uh, reassurance, I turn back to Cinta. It's probably. I. Uh, yeah. Amazement. You. Yeah. No idea what's going through that head right now, and it's probably not good. It's probably either not okay. good or we're going to be keeping that thing. And I'm just yeah, like, she wants to keep it. She a hundred percent wants to keep it. Yeah, and I'm just like, hmm, okay. I then turn back and I'll just like nod to what uh, Mochi said and put the weapons away properly, and then just start setting up the camp. Yeah. <laughs> Look, I'm sorry, I didn't, didn't realize there was other people here. Well, I don't know what you expected. Is that me? Glance. I don't even understand. What'd you say? Is that a mini Dritz talking? That's what he said. <laughs> what she said. <laughs> Seems to uh, take some delight in that and goes, Why, yes, it is! Neats. Um, Sorry, Dritz Durden. Dritz Durden? That's... Out... How did you come to be like this, if I may ask? Uh, I was made. Oh. Okay, same. <laughs> that seems to work. <laughs> Just a question. <laughs> And he like says under his breath, like probably like only uh, or probably only Yvonne can hear somewhat poorly, but made nonetheless. I think Yvonne and Cinder could probably both hear that. <laughs> it's time to approach the mini thing. If Cinder can hear that, she would so gleefully put her hands together and go, "I could help." Is that can't? a smart thing? Okay, Driz, all you need to know is the yeah. weapons are put away, but Inkdrop is approaching you and starting to circle you. Right. Hello? I'd really appreciate it, appreciate it if you didn't set me on fire again. Or crouching down and poking you at different sides. Hey, my off! <laughs> he, like, like, brushes your hand away. 
What is? Uh, a toy. Looks up to Mochi. Toys edible? Jeez, Who's yummy. not here at the second? God damn it. Okay, we'll change that over to Plum's not here either. Fuck. Yeah, <laughs> <You're t> <laughs> the, two, the two people that could probably help you with that because if you because if you try a mod, you get a shrug in mental image. Okay, then I'll switch over to Cinta. Is edible? Okay. As I'm poking Drez's mini thing. Gently sort of ushers your hand away. Can I eat? He's perfect. Could turn to familiar. No. You could keep forever then. I think I can keep him forever now. Look at him. There's just a sigh, but just no... There's like, no combatants to it. I will take good care of him. Cinta, you have no issue with reconnecting, yeah? Yeah. You're just here in your head. Okay, okay. I'll pick it up, I'll pass it to you while it's not looking at me. You don't have to... Wait, so... So, no picking it up? No, that's the breach of privacy. Okay. Uh, <laughs> for anyone outside of this, it's just like, you would just see a look between the two. Uh, and Driz, you just get a pat on the head. Before Ink Drop walks back to looking so where to set up. How big exactly is Driz? Uh, he is exactly two feet tall. So he is, <laughs> he is even smaller than Milton. Which is a... Uh... Cinta yeah. ends up crouching down to be as close to Driz as possible goes, Can I hold you? <sighs> if you must. You said you could fix me, right? I could do whatever you want. And she will pick up Driz and just squeeze to her chest. Jesus. <laughs> 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 As you squeeze, you hear you hear more sword swinging sounds. Oh, well that's real nice of ya. What the fuck? I'm stunned. Do something about the sword swinging sounds. I'm so just pet now, and nobody can touch. I'm just in bewilderment, and now I can't even combat against it. Like. Since there's a, a, been a too attached to it, so now I can't really do anything about it. Uh, Ink is not sure how to read the situation and offers you a leaf of own to calm your nerves. Uh, he takes it. Again, curiously. Uh, As not they really proceed nervous. to eat one themselves. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> um, yeah, she probably would actually eat it. She's gonna hair her gone. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, just something to calm nerves. Um, and just, yeah, go back to camp. Like, yeah. it up. As Mochi has decided this is where you're all gonna just sleep for the night, you all break off making beds throughout the evening. Uh, a good berry would be uh, summoned from Plum. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Plum, yes. Plum makes ten good berries and hands one to everyone and sort of walks up to Dritz and does that scene from, what's it called, uh, the, the oh. MCU, uh, yep. the, the scene with the burrito, <laughs> with the hog, yep, does, this, does this thing with the, with the single oh, good man, berry man. on Driz. <laughs> well, wait, 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 when, like... The Hulk thing when like Black Widow's like calming him. Yeah, yeah, with the tacos. <laughs> oh. oh wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, no, wrong one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Go. yeah. <laughs> Places <laughs> the yeah, yeah, very yeah, like, oh, hands. No, no, no. 
he like um holds out his hand to pass it back. He's like, "Oh no, that's all right. I'm all good." Okay. <laughs> Fix it up. <laughs> all, all, all good, Barry, for me. Yeah, one's not here, so I can't ask that question. Who's the next spellcast? That'll be Nessie. Uh, I Nessie. Yeah. Every yeah, every single person here. Uh, maybe <laughs> even Drez can cast them. You know what? I was already connected to Center. I'll just ask as these good berries are being handed out. If good berry comes from magic, is it vegetarian? Uh, uh, Probably. Uh, mm. hmm. Only Center hears this anyway, but. I'm, I'm now thinking myself, though. <laughs> No, what happens is Plum gets a whip and starts looking the trees in order to make the good berries. <laughs> you probably gotta Google this. Okay, while you Google that, let's. We should just move on. May the same way that. Oh, that's probably not. I was, I was gonna say, in the same way that, um. Like create food um, and water. If you wanted to create like meat in the lab, it'd be vegan. But then I was like, technically, it's not. It's just non-animal. But yeah. I mean, no nothing was. Oh uh, yeah, nothing was killed to produce it. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if that's unless, unless vegan, you count though. as killing the weave. <laughs> yeah, but, yeah, yeah, unless you count the weave as a sentient being, which. Is the weave a person? Well, isn't the idea that the <laughs> giggle the weave is a god? <laughs> Let's just that throw that out. The Mister herself, the weave <laughs> is, a, is a god a person? <laughs> okay, is a god. If you're person. consuming technically part of a god, I guess. Um, is there any more scenes while <laughs> uh, while uh, Inkdrop ponders the existence of? Gods and what they classify as. I need to know, said Savile. Like, are they staying near our tent? Oh, she will put Drew Does... in her, her like her bedroll if she can. She will okay. cuddle and sleep with Drew like a plushie if she can. Okay. I can't find it, so I'm gonna go Not... to the D and D Discord and ask. <laughs> so again, Rebecca. And she is uh. Hmm? Oh yeah, um, yeah he's, he's not, yeah, he seems quite com he seems quite comfortable with, like, yeah, you putting him in his uh, bedroll and, like, cuddling him. And, like, while you're getting set up and stuff, he's he's listing all the things he, wa he wants you to change it and, like, and fix with him. And she is mentally noting everything to start working on it. <laughs> like, first oh. of all, need new eyes. These are lilac, not lavender. There is a difference. She 100% has a collection of buttons that she brings out and just offers to pick one. She has so many knickknacks. I'm really left out. <laughs> his, his eye, as much as, as much as like, yeah, but like, inanimate button eyes can, they just like light up and he's, as he looks at all the button options. I will say, as like, as you look at all the buttons, uh, while there are quite a few dozen lilac ones, um, they don't fit. They, they they they're different sizes a than than each other, but b they're not the exact shade of lilac you want. We have to discover. Yeah, the that, sorry, yeah, I, no, I have lilac. I need lavender. Yeah, lavender. Yeah, they're not the they're not the exact shade of lavender that you want. <laughs> He's like, hmm. like yeah, like eyes, like you know, like <laughs> later for a moment, and then like as he scares him, like yeah, fades a bit. And he's like, hmm, they're better, but they're not quite right. I guess they will do for now until I can find the exact ones. We will find you the perfect one. <laughs> and, like he grab like the closest ones uh, he can find. The and I'm pair. Yeah, you pick out. You pick out like two. Uh, two mismatched, like, shirt size, but pretty much the same colour, lavender eyes, <laughs> and, <laughs> and then them over to Sento. <laughs> and she will uh, do her thing up, but they're all set up. Set up. What? 
I'm now curious what happened when you actually start doing something like that. And like, what happens yeah. to this? Yeah. What happens to this toy? <laughs> <laughs> it screams in pain. <laughs> oh yeah, I should be on second watch, shouldn't I? Yeah. Oh uh, yeah, me and Mima back when I look like you watchers. watchers. Yeah, Check if you wanna roll your your watch order, let me have a look at the watch order in case Plum needs to roll it all. Plum is a cat. And we'll Plum rolls one. first. Oh, all right. So. I mean, we're separate. Well, we we do our own separate ones, though. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, um, I don't know. Yeah. I remember. Did we? I was gonna say, did we rule that I roll a single one for the two watches, or just roll two? You roll two. Okay. Sorry, I guess it's all good. Back. I guess. I guess technically, Holy the fact that you would be, be with Cinta's watch. Mm, yeah, I mean, yeah, I don't know how much, depending on how, like, how she's uh, cuddling me, I don't know um, well, how much she's watch on I watch, can do. She, she probably has you in a lap and facing towards her or away on your path, your choice. Uh, yeah, um, yeah, he, I mean, yeah. I'll be back in a second. Help continue. Watch the he's looking, like, he looks somewhere else to, like, you know, cover more area. Um, where is it? <laughs> That's where the negative lie. We got such good perception during our watch. <laughs> <laughs> where was this in the game? Jeremy. It's fine. Yes. Yeah. Where was this in fucking fun. game earlier? <laughs> That's 19. Oh, yeah, no. I don't, I'm more impressed by Sam's age. I think I'm actually. Uh, hang on. I did that wrong. Okay. Someone I'm, has raised a good point to the question I, I asked before. Uh oh. Goodberry is a transmutation, not a conjuration. And the material yes. component is a sprig of mistletoe. Yes. Transmutes which mistletoe. usually has poisonous berries, so it's turning the poison into medicine. The berries are vegetarian. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, I mean, um, but on that topic, it was also pointed out that veganism is just very questionable in Faerun with the whole dryads and elementals and that. And then you've got the question of what about just an awakened tree? <laughs> there, okay. The correct one is a six. I have I'm back. Perception checks. Uh, AJ, please disregard my 19. As, yeah, as the night goes on... Perfect watch, guys. Uh, as the night goes on, everyone but Avon seems to be just, like, the concept of Driz is keeping them up away from proper <laughs> watch. That's what's making me be on proper watch. <laughs> um, in my defense, in has been plundering the uh, vegan diet yeah. in-game. As uh, the next day passes, the, the eighth of the eighth, eighth of eight day, one second. Eight, eight. Eight, eight. Eight, yeah, eight. We'll, we'll have your big numbers, you two. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Let's go. Do it, it'll be funny. Oh, it's not funny. I can roll again if you want. No, it's good. <laughs> Let's keep rolling. <laughs> you just keep telling me to roll. Uh, let me... It's gonna be good. It's gonna be this one. Uh, let me change the day. Cool. As uh, you all get up the next day, uh, you all get prepared to travel. Uh, okay, sure. We're just gonna roll with it. And yeah, I, I think we'll just keep it simple, keep it same, and just try to put normality into what we're doing in this weird jungle. Ink drops uh, drawed craft the night before has led them to find out that it will be uh, not raining, uh, it'll rise back up in temperature to about normal, and there'll be a light breeze throughout the day. <laughs> Thank you. A little bit, a little bit chilly. I usually will just tell first thing in the morning whoever I'm connected to without it. <laughs> yeah. So, either a center or on, I guess, in this case. What they do with oh. that information is up to them. Probably since she's usually the second one. 
Mm. Like on watch. <laughs> uh, unless anyone has any sort of difference to sort of go against. Uh, Avon's not really paying huge attention to this toy. Like, it's mostly just kind of trying just to go back to how stuff was being and just mostly trying to keep trail normal. Can I have another survival from everyone else? Other than Rich here, the of tower course. Everyone? Yes, in the tower. <laughs> what, whatever the puppet decides to do uh, with that survival, I have no clue. I've got ink drops already. It's just... Oh, sorry. I... No, no, it's all good. You got mine? Yeah. I got everyone's. I just I just needed Mochi's. Uh, I just needed everyone but Mochi. <laughs> everyone else. I only had three. Uh, mm -hmm. Let us go. Uh, Mochi, are we going fast or slow? Or normal? Let's keep a normal pace. Okay. Uh, plus one, plus three, plus four, plus five, minus. Not minus. Uh, three, four, and a three. Two, three, plus three on top of whatever you roll. Plus three. Uh, plus four, actually, my bad. I apologize. Oh. Well, I so don't know. Sure. 26. 26. Yeah, you can go where you want. I think we're about to end on dead territory. Down and left. Okay. Down and left. Ah, yep. My bit. So, but. Uh, down to this one, I guess. Um. Yeah. I oh, meant on like the diagonal. Oh, okay. Well, my bad. Diagonals down here? Uh, yeah, um, as you continue during the day, uh, the first two sections of your travel go relatively fine as well. Um, much like yesterday, as you're traveling uh, throughout the morning and stopping for lunch, you seem to be going pretty well. Um, as you continue to walk as you're going about your your day you see uh, a group of uh, uh, a group of Whoa. 17 uh, hadrosaurs uh, running nearby heading east not f like towards you but just like like in the distance running eastwards um, five of which seem to be small babies but um yeah 17 hadrosaurs those are the ones that are got the the skull inflection whatever like Cranidos and Rampados are based on oh, yeah. the large I remember correctly, oh, yeah, yeah. they are the, the skull is an Audi yeah duck build dinosaurs what <laughs> if I remember right they're herbivores <laughs> I think I know what you're talking about but I think the Wait, let me. You might be. I might be wrong. A hadrosaurus. Ah, the mate. Dinosaur names. There are dinosaur names. So they might just be bipedal. They're not either one that I thought. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's a family of um, different types of dinosaurs, which also includes um, the ones you are thinking of. Okay. The the ones that look like Cranidus and Rampados. Yeah. Yeah, Pachycephalosaurus. Oh, yeah. then they're not them. The hadrosaurus is like yeah, they're just. Big bipedal green guys. And there's not something. There's not real like crest or anything that distinguishes them. They have like a parrot beak, I guess. Yeah. Field, basically. Yeah. Um, and just a group of them seem to be heading east. Probably maybe fifty feet away from you. As you continue after your lunch break, a couple hours afterwards. Sorry, so that last part again, I, I got a little bit of a cut out there. This is just, it's just, these guys are heading east, it's like, it's like an hour or so after you've had lunch, as they're just sort of running parallel towards the east, like where you're going southeast. Okay, okay, cool, 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 cool. 
Uh, my main intention is to probably just ignore and let them pass because we have enough resources as is and we're kind of able to just not put ourselves into dangerous situations if we can help it. That's at least what Avalon puts out there. <laughs> Gets nods from... Drew's is fine with that. The toy has no bearing on any decision <laughs> in my mind, but it's oh. nice to know. I, I also assume he's still being carried by Cinta. You get the double Absolutely. nod, and I put the boomerang away. <laughs> yeah, as you, you all find a spot to rest for the evening, I guess. I'll have another round of perception checks. I'll let them go first. Oh, roll your bones, roll your bones, roll your so bones. So a six and a twenty-three. Mm, not as well. Not as well, Pepe. Um, we'll be picky and decide. Picky and decide. But they won't bear the berry? <laughs> Plum's busy snacking. My plum's busy making good berries. Okay, is question it, for is the sharing DM. Or no? the, is it Potential answer or... for the player. <laughs> Great question. Um, so, you use mistletoe to cast good berry, right? Yeah. Now, I need to ask, the source of the good berry <laughs> the plum has been oh using, God. does it come from an awakened plant? <laughs> <laughs> um, or is it... Let me just read good berry real quick. Um, he... Maybe that's why Plum Lord of White, you asked the question, he's in an existential crisis. Um, yeah, he's probably asked that question, he doesn't know. Um, for all intents and purposes, I think, I believe it, it just, he, it just manifests, like, <laughs> grapes. Um, I'm not sure how Floof sees casting spells, if he's using facsimiles of uh, components, or if he's just using his druidic focus, but I'll just say whatever he's using, it grows like a, a small bundle of grapes at the mm -hmm. bottom. So we can confirm it doesn't come from an awakened plant. He's got a blooming twig. The good fairy focus. doesn't have sentience. <laughs> I'm sorry. Gone. Yeah, yeah, we've just spiraled into a circle. Oh. Hi, Kato Tots. Sorry, we just don't we don't pay attention while we play game because we're playing game. But hey, that's we, sick. But we will talk about in in on breaks. My apologies. But hi, welcome. It is a six for your you thing roll. Rolled yours? Yeah, my thing roll. Oh right, yeah, that thing. Good. We're getting closer and closer. It's just we keep skirting it. Give another long rest. In time. It is inevitable. It is inevitable. Fucking today was inevitable. I'll talk about it on break. But <laughs> <laughs> um. But yeah. Next roll of survivals. Big number. Yeah, we've not actually like. Had too bad with this thing, so we'll keep it as similar. This is how I sabotage. I will it into being. I need one from Plum, mm -hmm. Ink Drop, and Nessie. Mm -hmm. I'm going to change up my spells while we do this. Oh, good. Alright, so for Mochi, are we doing a short, fast, or normal speed again? For some you're reason good. today. For some reason today is the full send, but for no reason. It's like, we're barely 
70 miles out from Port Nianza. <laughs> Should be way hey, flat for this. It's been at least a day. It's been at least one day. And that's more than zero. Did Jeremy be our again? I hope so. No, sorry, I was eating. No, oh, good, my bad. No, no, that's all good. Eat when you can. Uh, what did you need from me? Uh, are we going fast, slow, or normal? Um, been a couple of days, haven't had an issue. I think, um, I'm going to be faster, <laughs> my uh, Totally not bite us in the arse. Alright, so, minus, the being. minus five already. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, then it's a minus six, minus five, minus six, Guys, minus so seven, good. minus eight, minus seven. Alright, so minus mm. seven. We haven't even the boost hat. Minus. No, no, no. Minus. If someone's just constantly casting guidance. Uh, That'd be fine, I'll just roll high. Guys, I didn't roll high. You know what? <laughs> it's too late now, but I was gonna you, say, you... comprehend languages and read the trees. Yeah, and that is using your inspiration for him, correct? That's how that works? It's all good. <laughs> uh, Can I give him my inspiration? If you want to. I can't do that. You know what, take my inspiration, I'm helping you. So roll again. Yeah, roll, roll again. Or worse, that'd be hilarious. Yeah. Is it he's still used the hot Hey! Okay. Probably still not enough. enough. Uh roll me a D4. Yep. Yep. It's not enough. Okay. Oh. Please tell me you started from up. <laughs> Somehow we crossed the river. He ran into river. Don't ask how. I don't know. Okay. Um, yeah, you guys keep up some fast pace for the day. Uh, let me just roll your, your day. Yeah. Um, and as you continue to go, you start walking. Um, and eventually you find a river. However, hey. it's on your oh. west. Please be off the oh. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? <laughs> Yeah. That's where we wanted to go initially, I'm just saying. You made two tiles of progress, but in the opposite direction. <laughs> we, we went Me. down a little bit, so that is still it's progress. Still it's still, still down. down. Honestly, honestly, so far, not, never punished by, <laughs> by running. Unpunished. The I'm actual... Really do it again tomorrow. The actual running part, it goes well for you. <laughs> the direction part, that's where it's a little... Look, we went... The correct direction, like when you look at the, the two halves. Okay. So it's close enough. Yeah. As uh, we mm. all roll perception checks again for the evening. Yep. Sure. <laughs> I'm the one that doesn't have to roll these, right? Because I don't have a watch. Yes. If you don't have a watch, then. I like how you manage to get yourself out of a watch. Hey, I lead the party during the day. I need all the sleepy I can get. <laughs> Yeah, I have so many eyes. If they're all sleepy, I can't see where I'm going. I, I am co-leading you. <laughs> I'm helping okay. you mostly. You know what, AJ, you can read. I don't need to read them out for you. I can. Uh, yeah, you got a point. What am I reading? Uh, it's like it's a six and a fourteen. I'm like, oh yeah, read. I can do math for you. <laughs> no, but tell them what the numbers are. What do they mean? Fuck you. <laughs> Come on, Mason. Oh. Kiss my ass. <laughs> oh no. Um, yeah. The evening, while distracting for Driz as he's sort of fretting that if he's picked the right lavender eyes this evening, <laughs> he's, he's getting t as, um, Sinto is yeah, talking him down. Since that's going over, like, multiple rests. <laughs> she brings the buttons out every night in case it's one to prefer. Um, yeah, uh, because it brought up, but I didn't really explain it, as, like, the surgery to replace the eyes happens, like, there is no pain or anything, it's just, it's like, uh, it's like a Warforged doing, like, Warforged things, it's just, he takes off his blind and an eye, and then you put it back on, he's, he can see again. The mud, the, the, like, the buttons themselves are not even magical, <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry, are you doing this, like, out in the open? Yeah. Cool, she's Ink would find it intriguing at some point if there are. I imagine you do most of it like before the sleep stuff happens. I imagine 
think she's kind of doing it during watch, so like she's half paying attention to the watch, okay. and half paying attention to Drew's. Alright, night before, weather check. <laughs> uh, yeah, the night before weather check, let's uh, give it a go. I shouldn't make just a table that rolls 1d1 all and it. then rolls all of them at once. 1d1? <laughs> Yeah, because yeah, you just works. you just want it to roll it all at once, so it doesn't matter. You want all the tables to roll at the same time, so it doesn't really matter, like that they are different rolls. Uh, 14, 20, 19. Uh, it's going to be a strong day with a little bit of light wind, and it is going to be uh, another probably twenty degrees warmer than today. I Pardon me. Proceed to inform Plum that their fur is fucked for the next day. God damn it. This is Fahrenheit. Or God selfish. damn it. Uh, I mean, the setting would be in Fahrenheit because they're American, but it'll be. Well, this is bullshit. I don't want to be here anymore. Nah, real Chad's measure degrees in Kelvin. It's going to be Kelvin. negative 203 Kelvin tonight. I'm happy to go Kelvin. Brisk. Um, yeah, let's get everyone's survivals. Brisk negative. Uh, I'm afraid to roll survival at this point. Into the tower, of course. If I didn't purposely nerf myself, I would have access to guidance for this very situation every night. You know what? I'm gonna no, try. It's okay. I'm gonna but try. It. Plum is not can I... guidance at all. AJ, mm -hmm. can I potentially give a plus one by comprehending languages on the trees? Mm. The language. The, tr speak. the trees don't speak. A combination between <laughs> druid craft and yeah, the Trees languages. don't speak. Yeah. They bark. There is a there is a oh. combination of comprehend languages and and trees. It's called speak with plants, and you don't have that spell. <laughs> or just be a furball. <laughs> you idiot! You should just prepare to speak with plants next. Someone else cast it, and I can. Mm, not uh, me. Mason, what's the numbers? Uh, I need I need one more number from Cinto. Sorry, my bad. It's so good. Actually, can I learn to speak with? No, I can't. No. All right, so, uh, are we going fast or slow or normal? I, I said I'm going fast again. All right, so minus five, plus four, <laughs> minus oh. five, plus four, minus five, plus four. Negative four. I don't know. Plus five. Minus four. Just roll minus minus four. Minus four. Minus four. Hey, look, positives. Yeah, you guys got positive. Like the day before Actually, yesterday, negative, you were the oh. day. <laughs> Who's got inspiration? It Who's got inspiration? Matter what it would be. That's bad. <laughs> Who's got inspiration? I do. Ooh, that's a shame. The the day before, I, like yesterday. I'm about to walk off a cliff. The, the day I, before I, yesterday, I, yeah, I, you guys I, were cracked. You rolled like everyone rolled above the target for the day yeah. before. It's just these next two days, everyone's been really shit or somewhere around. You know okay. what? Mochi rolled badly because I tried to speak with the trees. Ah, uh, and we got distracted. Alright, roll a d4, Mochi. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I... I'm not entirely helping either because I keep getting distracted by uh, the toy that's taking all of Sinto's time. Unpunished. <laughs> Please. Three tiles, <laughs> like, across the river. Do it. Uh, you... Guys, just seemingly follow the river south today. Oh my... Unpunished. <laughs> However, there's 16 T-Rexes and they're all looking at you. Oh, neat. Again, your, <laughs> your trip... <laughs> your trip seems to have no bearing. There are no surprises waiting for you this day as you what? continue traveling. You're just, you're just the goat. I'm built diff, actually, I'm a spider. You kind of are built diff. We all are, in a way. And that's what makes each of us special. Mine is my blind ignorance when navigating forests I've never been in before. <laughs> and for recklessness. Why did Flixie say they were tonight? A wedding, right? Yeah. Yeah. Don't look back. Who's the wedding send... buff? I'm just gonna send him a message. Does he get ceremony? <laughs> Lucy, what is your focus what? made of? It's a D100. What's that? It's a D100. It's a glowing streak. I, I'm literally telling you. D100, ain't it? <laughs> oh, good. I'm as, good. yeah, as you all sit down and prepare for us, what's happening? Uh, I imagine, like, considering this is, like, the, the third day, 
of it. It's it's that guard that was there for Avon has diminished a bit. Just seeing that it is just kind of like what what does um Driz do during like travel stuff? Are you just mostly just talking about themselves? Yeah, what is the conversation of Driz uh, and Avon? <laughs> uh, Dr uh, Driz and Sinter be throughout a shift? Uh, yeah, I need to know what's taking away Sinter's attention. <laughs> well, I did, I did just yes. send a, I did just send a meme a list of the things yeah. that uh, he once worked on. Do you explain yeah. them? We're doing body mods. I I hundred percent imagine he has a backpack which is normally like on the back in front of her. He's sitting on it, and she just pulls things out to show like maybe this one or this one. I'm kind of imagining the scene in Toy Story Two when the guy comes in to like um fix Woody and like like tidies him up. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The things I've said is that yeah, like his. The, his skin color is like light gray instead of dark gray. His cloak is like moss green instead of forest green, and it doesn't have the like the wool uh, trim at the top. Uh, and his like his arms have like uh, most all of them, especially his arms have like way too much stuffing in them, and he looks like a hench, like much more than he should be. He's like a, a slender, you know, quick, you know, ranger boy. Yeah. I would like to once again try to connect with Driss. I'm not giving yeah, you any okay. warning. I'm just trying. <laughs> yeah. So, well, yeah. Yes. Yeah, so, like when you do, like, what is it? Like, what is the initial like contact? I don't even like, think. Yeah. I imagine it's just, I imagine it's just a prick in your mind. Like, just yeah. that's what I think. But nothing major. Like you it's get a ping on Discord. Basically, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I hate that. Mute. Uh, yeah, he'll, 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 yeah, he'll resist. Ah, goddamn. <laughs> Just like, oi! Who's there? Speaking to the gods. Um, <laughs> in that like, case, uh, uh when I well. notice you're resisting again, I will connect back to Cinta. <laughs> <laughs> Do they want a tattoo? Oh, uh -huh. there's invisible links. Um, Drews? <laughs> yeah? Inkdrop wants to know if you want a tattoo. I'm waving in the background. Uh. <laughs> <I> am... <laughs> what, some ink wants to give me a tattoo? Yeah, I, I think so. Uh, I'm not really sure how that would work. And I don't think uh, Dritz has tattoos. There it is. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. I mean, I don't know for sure. I've uh, I've never met the man. What? And he could have something. Un <laughs> <laughs> we don't know what's under that. Could have. <laughs> yeah, the butcher was about to say like, oh, we don't. I don't know what's under his armor. Or his clothing. You're trying to imitate something you don't know? Um, no, it's not. I don't know him. I know his dress. There's nothing wrong with that, Avon. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> one, of, one, of, one of the greatest heroes in the Forgotten Realms. Avon backs down. She just kind of like just back down, just lets it lets it go, and then just doesn't say anything. <laughs> Ink has no idea who you've all been on about this entire time. I'm kind of half leave you. I would know the name, and that's it. <laughs> Ink's not from this realm. We'll just go back to setting up camp. We'll just do that. Yeah, yeah, it sounds good. <laughs> just like yeah, just like goes away. It's like okay, back back, back to setting that up because I uh, yeah, I just I don't want to. It's just no, it's not. It's fine. Mm -hmm. It's fine. I 
should stop preparing a tattoo to give to someone. Sure. Yeah. We'll have uh, everyone roll perception checks, I guess. Hmm, <laughs> because these haven't been cursed today. <laughs> That's it. I'm changing my dice color. <laughs> you probably need to, yeah. Put, <laughs> put them into the forge. Yeah, give me give me one hey, second. But wait until all the rolls before putting them in the forge. Yeah, I will. <laughs> Uh, we're still needing checks from three others. Hmm. Well, yeah, uh, uh, we need one from Nessie. Plum or Nessie. Yeah. Three? All oh, right. Yeah, because no, she doesn't do them. I keep forgetting that. That's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> one, two, five. Oh, perception? Yep. Yeah. Clearly this means we've found the perfect eyes. Uh, I think <laughs> Plum is doing it. <laughs> Oh, these eyes are great! I can see so much with them! Okay. Um, yeah. As night goes on... Um, oh, as As the night goes on, as you all are watching... Uh, Inkdrop, you are too busy just thinking of tattoos to design to hear as... Um, out of the group of three... Out of Sinta, um, Drez, and Yvonne, which of you would be up around the middle of the night? Middle? That's... Direct We kind of... Um, that's a, that's I... hard, because I feel like for me and Sinta, we kind of swap that midway through. So... Okay, so... I... so you... I, w I would be regardless, because... Um, yeah, yeah. Like, when I'm, cause when I'm doing a long rest, I'm still conscious yeah. during mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. Um, well, okay, we'll say this is during the, the the transitional period as one of you is waking okay. up the other. Um, as you all, as all three of you immediately, like, turn as you hear a snap in the twigs. Um, as there seems to be a large group of people uh, making their way surrounding you and your party. Uh -oh. like, is there any chance, like, where we hear them to the point where we have that moment to prepare? Or is it straight away? Uh, you can do an action. Oh my god. And just don't worry about it. He's, he's like setting his dice. It's oh, fine. Yeah. Yep, yep, right, yep. He's failing them. I'd let you, an action? Okay. I'd let you, yeah, I'd let you not be surprised sort of deal. You can, you could use your action to wake up the others and then they wouldn't be surprised yeah. either, but like, but you have, you have an action. Yeah, yeah it's jumps out of uh Sinta's arms or bed or wherever he is at the moment and like is like doing the action of like rolling up his sleeves. <laughs> Stars yeah, getting leather. Real clearly sick getting of ready for not him. having any armor. Same <laughs> oh, I'm, not go uh, I'm gonna be honest, when I rolled tonight's encounter it was the hadrosaurs again, I'm like no. nah. <laughs> let's see what else gets rolled. <laughs> It's like, yeah, but what if? Well, like, that's a cool option, but what if we did this? Uh, my action, I guess, mm -hmm. will be to immediately cast a Wild and Bond. Um, like, as a bonus action, then with any remaining bit of time, is to try to, like, loudly just let people know that someone's around. Just not yep. scream, scream, but just, like, quick, something's around here. I'll Being allow, cornered. I'll allow everyone to wake up from that if they want, and they can, um... You, you won't be surprised, you'll just have to stand up from prone on your turn. Mm -hmm. You bomb. want the, uh, the big guy? Yeah, everyone roll the big guy. Um, I will say, as the three wake up, as you look around, you, you guys have mostly got dark vision, right? Uh, I don't. I have blind sight as well. Don't... I don't either. I got dark vision. Does Santa have dark vision? I think okay. Santa does, out of the three of us. Um, oh, okay. <laughs> Wait, no one... That's Wait, no, 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 Plum does. I can't see. Cinta's got dark vision. Do, do I? It says on your sheet you've got dark do vision. You? On I your main you... on your main page. Oh, what? It was covered. <laughs> I, um, I can see. Though you I can't can though you can't see the colour, because it is it, it is distinct. Yeah. You see that these group of color. warriors um have this triangle triangle pointed downwards on their on their forehead. Um they all have that. As, yeah, initiative has been rolled, I guess. Let me put on battle music if I haven't already. And uh, top of the order is center. Don't forget you're targeting your. Actually, 
Actually, we will quickly take our bio before we have battle. That's probably the better thing to do. I might do that. So we'll go do our bio break and then we'll jump into battle. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. So I talk with Darian. Mm -hmm. He says to mm -hmm. me. What? It is a berry, therefore it is vegan. Does not matter. Yes, but it's just complicated because of the way magic works. <laughs> okay. If you I understand that logic. You, I don't want to argue. If you true polymorphed a person into a sprig of mistletoe and kept the concentration up, and then used that sprig of mistletoe to make the berry, I can see where the dilemma might be. Okay. So let me throw an alternative question at you then. What if the focus is made out of animal? The focus isn't made out of animal. It, it's a stick. We don't, but, know that. we don't know where Plum got it. Plum isn't here to answer that. It's a blooming twig. It is a twig. Yeah, not that's made out of flesh. To be fair, I also don't actually know it what focus Plum uses. I don't even know if you can if a piece of animal is an option for a druidic focus. Yeah, you could at just least hide. Like, in you, you uh, actually can, yeah. I mean, yeah. A totem, a wooden staff, they could you be... You could also use bones. Oh, that's a special wooden staff. You want to call out of a living tree or um, a totem yeah. incorporating feathers for so bones and teeth from the sacred animals. <laughs> At the end of the day, it's just a question that I felt like stupidly asking. Oh, no. You got my head round this, alright? I am in the game. I need to go and eat food, because I am starving, and I mm -hmm. haven't eaten that much all day. Go ahead. If you, can't, if you will... can't handle riding off into the sunset, you better stay away from Hot Pockets. I will discuss shenanigans <laughs> that happened this week, and especially today. Hey, uh, Rebecca. I'll be right back. Just one quick question. Rebecca. Yeah, hi. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. It was such a good thing, making her character. Because Rebecca's like, I want to play in Japan, but I don't know what to do. And I was like, what do you oh, mean? Oh, okay. And... Uh, yeah, I was, yeah, I was like, I want to play in Japan. I have, like, this rough idea of, like, being made by someone, but, like, not being made correctly or not being made, being finished. But, like, I don't know, like, where to go with that of, like, what the, like, mess up is. Or what, what exactly is Japan? And I can I see those stats? Japan are puppet people. Yeah. Uh, like, they're... Yeah, it's, uh, from the Volders. They're from the Volders. You think thing. replicas it's would from... count? Yeah, it's, it's from Volders Spire of Secrets. Yeah, it's like, um, you make, uh, it's like a Warforged, but, like, they're supposed to be a marketable something. And so, I'm sitting there listening to Rebecca, and I'm just like, well, that sounds like you could totally be, like, Mordenkainen or Tash from, a, like, you could be a, a puppet of them, but you're not quite right, and you want to be fixed correctly. And I'm like, you could be Dritz, it'd be the funniest thing if you were Dritz. <laughs> but it just slowly came to be, it's like, yeah, Dritz is probably the most popular, there's, like, probably lots of books, and there's epic tales about Dritz every time he does things. Dritz is also the most thing. stoic, so you can immediately ruin that image. Yeah, <laughs> so, we were like, <laughs> we were like, you could be Dritz, and it'll be the funniest thing. The original idea, because I heard Japan, and I was like, oh, they're probably like a Pinocchio Bloodborne guy because of the Pinocchio Bloodborne game. Um, and I'm like, oh, the initial introduction that I was going to have is that you guys were going to find a holy tree and just see, like, a, a wooden face poking out of it and be like, oh, that's just a weird tree. <laughs> and then I'll have Rebecca go, hey, you mind getting me out? <laughs> and you help. <laughs> help. Help. <laughs> but we were like, uh... Oh. We but, like, Dritz is, like, looking for a panther, so she attacks the party because she thinks some of them could be a panther. Yeah, because yeah, I initially, like, because I, we're, we're, I was at a point where I was like, okay, it's got to be either Minsk or uh, Dritz. And I was like, if it's Minsk, then it could be, like, I'm out, I'm out here to, like, trying to find, like, a hamster to, like, have my own boot. And we lost really the rat. Like, <laughs> yeah. And then I remembered that Dritz actually has a panther companion. <laughs> as well and it, it's great that we've got um he would just say he's like i don't know what background to pick i'm like well you're folk here if you're Dritz, because he's a folk here <laughs> you you just have <laughs> his folk ness inbuilt in your system <laughs> you just need to get folk here but yeah i think it's really funny People need to be like, ah, oh, Dritz, yeah, come on in, buddy. <laughs> and I was like, yeah, you can just do a, a we can just do a shitty Photoshop of like 
real art for Dritz. <laughs> we don't have to bother with like looking or uh, making something. <laughs> it's just like yeah. <laughs> Rebecca sent like a whole list of great ones yesterday, and I was like, you've made the difficult decision of you having to pick one now. <laughs> One had googly eyes, which is always great. Um, the other one was just pink eyes that just like pierced their so- your soul, staring at it. And I'm like, well, these are all great. I was just like looking up um, like plushy eyes to like like find ones, and yeah, and one of them is uh, like where it's like the iris is like really glittery and like obviously various oh. colors. So, yeah, but when you put them on top of the just regular picture of Dritz, it's so terrifying. There's a funny thing. Yeah, I... it in... <laughs> There's a funny thing that will happen if it comes up, but I'll explain it anyway. If it doesn't, it's <laughs> you're like, how does he have money? And I was like, it's great. Like he just shuffles through his pockets, and he's like, I've got these many, be- I've got this many buttons. And when he hands oh. the buttons to other people, it just turns into gold coins, <laughs> and vice versa. <laughs> It's so dumb. What? It's just like, yeah, I've got a bit of string, some buttons, a tag, and hands it all over, and it turns into currency. I assume you're playing the Geppetto, by the way, right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm just oh, happy to see yeah, someone use it. Japan, there it is. It is it. honestly a very fun race. It's marvelous. Yeah, when I when fun. I saw it, I was like, okay, I, like I this has to be my backup because you, you say a living really puppet, really I have many ideas now. Yeah, so the Tibetan <laughs> has three um, oh. essentially very minor differences between its three sort of sub races. You have the bisque, the marionette, and the plushie. Did you can bisque be is like your um, fun, a porcelain dolls. Marionette is obviously your wooden, you know, Pinocchio. That, that, and then I was thinking plushie. replica. Yeah, and plushies are like your raggedies. Yeah. Uh, also, in doll, that's perfect. Plum, plum can turn into a <laughs> into a panther. They could, yeah. Perfect. <laughs> I um, just realized if you took a tattoo, uh, I actually do have a perfect one that would go with your race. Hmm? I'm pretty sure I have one that is literally designed around, um, you know, taking bludgeoning damage and then dealing it back. Ooh, okay. <laughs> I'm just double checking what it does because I also thought about it. It's like, okay, I could give tattoos to a few of you. I just haven't offered as of yet. No. We were, um. <laughs> it was great. Today, we, uh, everyone here except Rebe- except the girls, I guess, is the best way to do it. Uh, we played D&D for the first time in our Tomb of Elemental Evil campaign. It's a 1D and D. Not the new one D and D, but first edition D and D remastered to fifth, and it went okay until we went to a fight. <laughs> we went to the wrong fight, <laughs> and it was Farewell? like it was six giant frogs, uh, and we got TPK. However, they're a CL quarter. <laughs> there was just six Ow. of them. <laughs> uh, they we missed attacks and we weren't super efficient about things, but like. They could also restrain and then eat if they didn't really do it. I was running, I'm running a blood hunter, a blood mage with 9 HP. <laughs> like, it didn't go well. <laughs> but we had two hero moments. Well, three. We had a half orc fighter. He went down, got back up with his relentless endurance. And then he got down again. And then he rolled a 20, like three turns later. And I rolled a 20, like the first time I went down. <laughs> We tried, man. We went down to Ron Frog. I had three people saved from dying. <laughs> but it, it, it didn't go well. There was a constant struggle where Demetrius character was in the water uh, and survived his death saving throws, but because he was in the water, was drowning. So the only way to resolve that is uh, he oh constantly God. makes death saves until he either dies or someone saves him. <laughs> That's like the ruling on how you do that. <laughs> yeah, because you're suffocating. That's just how it works. Mm. I Unless healing has gone into you, in which case you're just constantly drowning. Okay. I have come up with another stupid question. Is Nessie pescatarian? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I, I know exactly I, what that Nessie... is, and I love that. <laughs> Nessie is an omnivore. She eats no, 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 I'm not asking what Nessie is. I'm asking, like, would Nessie count as eating pescatarian? <laughs> Would you ah. eat pescatarian? <laughs> you would eat fish, yes. She lives in the water. 
fish. Fish eat other fish. Are you a fish or a human in this case? In which case, it's like, are you... Would this be pescatarian or carniv 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 carnivorism? Carnivorous pescatarianism. You see where my mind is going? <laughs> I don't know, well, this started with you just looking up good berry. You have gills. Yeah, I have gills, but I'm half demon. I'm, okay. I'm, not, I'm not a fish. I might look like a fish, but I'm not a so fish. So carnivorous. So do you come do from Avernus, or uh, do you come from the ocean? I come from the ocean. Hmm. That makes you a fish, boss. <laughs> And there is literally a fish called a devil fish, I'm pretty sure, so, I mean... <laughs> yeah. Probably. My, my, my mum was a fish... a fish diokai. Uh, my father was a... an elf. So... Pretty bit of a nasty shock when he found out. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, what, I, I was like, that's not. Mm -hmm. uh, also, in future, AJ, uh... Would you care if for one session I just, uh, anyone asks me a question, I just give them a Cards Against Humanity response? <laughs> Within reason. Sure. Yeah. There'll, there'll be some I'd obviously filter out. Uh, no, I mean, <laughs> as long as you let me know what session it is beforehand, let the party know what session it is beforehand, sure. Yeah. Yeah, it's more fun if they don't know. At least let him know. <laughs> I'll, I'll let the DM know, sure. As long as it's this campaign and not any other Laroni. <laughs> it would be this or Broad, it wouldn't be any of the others. That I makes sense. Broad's probably the only other one where it's like, okay, this would probably be fine. We can get away with it. We can get away with a lot in Broad. <laughs> broad is the fuck it we ball campaign. <laughs> Absolutely. This campaign is like, let's just do fun stuff and silly and fuck it we ball. And Brad is like, let's be semi-serious about this and fuck it we ball. But fuck it we ball. <laughs> let's be semi-serious about this story and what potentially this could lead to, because it's really interesting. But also, fuck it we ball. Also, somehow we're all monks. That's fine. In my strata, I almost, I, I almost had to go and look up a fucking source book for the Feywilds, because they decided that's how they can <laughs> escape. <laughs> So they pondered the idea because one of them is a fairy, right? And mm -hmm. they know about uh -huh. fairy rings, you know, the rings of mushrooms you can find out in the wild. Hey, do I know that? Yeah. They are technically sure. considered portals to the fey realms if you're going off real mythos. It, it's a whole thing. Look up, watch Coraline. It actually does cover some of this. I might need that. Wait. Funnily enough, yes, Coraline actually covers the whole fey wilds. Uh, not fey wilds, the um, magic mushroom rings. I Just don't remember that in Coraline. So you've watched Coraline, yes? Uh, once many, many years ago. Yeah, so there's a whole thing with the books and that. Um, basically, the other world was sort of opened when she stepped into that mushroom ring at the start of the movie. Mm. There, there's a uh, lot behind it. Instead but it's... of the uh, like doorway thing in the house. Well, sort of. It's like stepping into that basically gave the key to that door in a, in, in a sense. It, it's... There's, uh, there's okay. a, whole, a whole YouTube video you can look up on it. it it's But yeah, point is... They basically proposed this theory, and then I had to look up, okay, what source books do we have that can do an adventure in the Feywilds? And the only one that came up was Witchlight, I think. And I don't actually know if that's a good uh, book for doing that. I didn't really have much of an answer when I asked it, so... I, yeah. Have any of you, have you experienced uh, the Witchlight book? Is it any good? The Wild Beyond the Witchlight? Yeah. Other than uh, reading it, not really. No, it not at for, uh, If they want to go to the Feywild. Uh, I think you start off sort of oh, in the Feywild or in going to the Feywild, like... Which is what they'd be trying to do, yeah. Yeah. So I'd just have to probably homebrew the start, I'm guessing. Just good to know for future. Just it's yeah. jumping from Curse of Strahd to World Beyond the Witch Lake. <laughs> Does that mean Strahd's just influencing the Feywild at this point? Um, what are you gonna do? Well, look at it this way. Strahd nearly seduced one of them. <laughs> That's sort of his prerogative, yeah. Yeah, Strahd, Strahd last session for them kind of showed up at the, um, what do you call it, the, the Wizards of... Yeah, yeah. Wizards of Wine. Oh, uh, the, the wine? 
basically they killed several flo well technically it was that they, they killed several flocks of the ravens there laying on the ground and one of my players happens to but was he me. allowed in no but he kept knocking it was very ominous <laughs> it wasn't until they went outside that he was able to actually approach them all right cool it's all matters <laughs> they would have been fine if they stayed inside <laughs> yeah <laughs> what i do like about doesn't necessarily need to follow the rules of Andrew at all. He just chooses to. Uh, right. Um, everyone's more or less back, right? Yeah. I just want to quickly um, yeah. mention, uh, like, if any of you want to tattoo at some point, I've got a couple I can give you. Um, one's called Gentle Path, one's called Troublemaker, and one's called, um... Uh, well, there's the one I've got, the Linking, then you've got Gentle Path, Troublemaker, and Unlocking. Do you want to put, put all those descriptions just into the, um... The indie chat? Yeah, yeah, I'll just chuck them in. Yeah, Only definitely. thing I'd say about the, the Feywild is obviously do what you want. If you think it's going to be a fun time going to the Feywild, go to Feywild. Just make sure they can actually leave the plane, because I'm trying to remember if it even it's lets you. It's complicated. Yeah. doesn't. Really. It, it gets really complicated. If it was just leaving regularly, that'd be obviously a no, but what they proposed actually somewhat makes sense. My funny idea would be let them go to the Feywild, but when they leave that, they just go back to Barovia. <laughs> I'm just trying to see if I remember if they like if there's a ruling on like plague shift in that campaign. Because there I was a ruling think there might be, it. but that's just yeah, plague yeah, shift. But no, but honestly, again, do yeah, what you want. I like the stupidity. No, do what oh, you I'm want. Gonna... <laughs> just make sure you loop back to Barovia. Eventually, yes. Because that'd be funny. <laughs> Or um, do the even funnier option, like make them go back, but Barovia still haunts them at every turn in the in like the material plane. Just so make they eventually go back and watch their uh, corpses on the floor die. Make them go back now. There's a future Barovia. Okay, there you call, go. Call it dice camera action two. You know what? I might adjust those text size. <laughs> but yeah, I think we're back. Let's uh, let's jump into combat if everyone's here. Oh wait, I figured out the thing. Uh, did I add it there? Slash you here? No. Uh, the, I've got a mod that just like lets me know who which people voted, and I was like, oh, it doesn't work, and then I realized, oh, it's a different command. Command, command, command. Command, commander. All right, top of the order is center. Oh right, combat. I totally forgot. <laughs> I'm so distracted with everything else. <laughs> Troublemaker fits center so well. Let's do the inside. Just gonna double check something real quick. Oh, good. Alright, I'm going to cast Bless at first level. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put it on Yvonne, Driz, and Loki. Okay, okay. Anywhere I can move safely, so that's my turn. All right, Trouble Warrior Nine, make their way towards uh, Nursey. Uh, and let me just read this. I'm looking pretty cool. Okay. Okay. Cool. All right. Uh, let me also just do this so I can, you know, be smart. Make sure everyone in square. Uh, yep, and yep, yeah, okay. Cool. Alright, everyone's in the square. This guy at the bottom, he's on a half. Oh, yes. He can be on a half. He, he's fine, he's cool, he's chill like that. Okay, cool. Alright. Uh, this one walks up to Nessie and will go for a spear attack, two-handed. Uh, you are prone, so advantage. I'm not, I'm just not going to put the prone on you because I assume everyone's going to stand up. <laughs> but that's a miss. 19. Make their way over to Avon. Spear two-handed. That's a hit. Um, I'll take this one. Will I wielding actually? Spear. Just a spear, I'll take it. Okay, uh, two-handed spear. 
stab it away up. Uh, two damage to either of the two of you. Oh. Send this concentration to still up. Ink drop, your top. Drizz, you're on deck. Mm. Also, Bond was more important to keep up for a bit. Oh boy, this is a fun one. Well, let's. You know what? Let's open it up the way I like to. I'm going to drop the spell. So, action. Time shift. <laughs> Maybe. Um, and then I'm going to. Now I just remember how big that is. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, do I want to do it that way? Um, as I will then one, two, three, four, using my blind side in here, obviously. Mm -hmm. Um, and then as a bonus action, uh, I will apply a stack of my bad ink to my rapier. Okay, okay. Drez, you're up. Yvonne's on deck. Drop that. Okay. <laughs> you're out there? I'm not doing it. No, this Drez. <laughs> wanting to do something. <laughs> okay. Usually it adds like a second layer, but for some reason it's not. Yeah, Might be needed, Rebecca. It. Just to let you know. Oh, sorry, I I, unmute. I thought I was unmuting myself, but I was muting myself. Yeah, uh, I, I was accidentally moving the cloud. That hits. Sorry. Sweet. Um. Yeah, uh, to, to Cinta and Yvonne and anyone who was like, oh, this is Dreads, you notice the Dreads does not use the sword on his back, one, one of the two swords on his back. He just goes up and punches him. You're a mug. <laughs> I love him. <laughs> I'm mad. Uh, nah. Are you pugilist? And then, I'm going to I'm going to spend a moxie point to give him the old one two. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mm -hmm. uh, what's a pugilist? <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's a strength based mox. Uh oh. That is a miss. Okay. Well, I get two of them, so. <laughs> that is a hit. Wait. Okay. Sorry. Let's go blast. Nine. Uh, one of my favorite remixes I'm playing in right now. <laughs> oh, sorry, that was great. Love. Um, hang on. That, can I just still be a four? Because I accidentally did the um, D8 instead of the D6. No. <laughs> what do you want me to re roll it? I can uh, re roll it. Yeah, just roll, just roll a D6 into the. Just, just roll a D6 and we'll see if it changes the number. Yep. It does. One plus five. He exceeded his one HP by two anyway. Uh, so eight would have been six, so he'd be up on one. Oh, come on. Bye. Alright, um... It's action by section. Yeah, I'm having it. Um... It's a very elegant... I will, uh, leave it for now. Okay. If I you're up, Mo, she's on deck. Cool. Yeah, first, it's a fun class. First things first, I guess. Uh, I need to double check. I don't have a thing for entangle. It's twenty foot square. I don't know why uh, I don't have a thing for it. Just drop the spell back on your spell sheet. Okay, I'll do that. I'll do that. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. You can just drag the square that you had, put it on your thing, and then delete the old one. But do it your uh, way. <laughs> Alright, it's okay, I'm just trying to help out. <laughs> Those three... Is this three. immediate, or is this the same as web? Uh, when you say this, so it's immediate. immediate. Yeah. Okay. yeah, I'm just trying to figure out which one exactly I'd probably do. I'd probably do this, so it hits these three. So it's halfway through their yeah. squares. Go ahead. Uh, boom, boom, boom. I'm playing the wrong person. Why does it allow me to touch, like, step on another character? Does it not give you the pop up to pick the thing? Probably not. Interesting. Yep. Uh, so, immediate cast of a spell of entangled to try to trap the people in front of me. Go ahead. They all seem to break three. 
Mm, that's not fun. As the vines start wrapping around them, they just go <laughs> and like flex and rip the entangle off. Cool. Uh, as part of the spell cast, I'm going to use a virtuous branch to give graceful protection. Uh, no, I'm going to give myself fortify. Okay. Which I think I already technically have on me. No, that's something else. Uh, I'll give myself fortify. And that will be my action. I don't really have a bonus action I can use right now. Oh, no, I do actually now. I forget this. Mm hmm. Who's in 30 feet? Who do I want to command? Uh, I need to remember how this works. Uh, man, one out in 30 feet for yourself to attack, but I can see you. One weapon attack as a reaction, so weapon attack, that's a problem with these people. I guess I would, like, seeing this, like, posh run up and punch it, and, like, noticing that, like, we're starting to get surrounded, it's that sort of thing of, like, that kind of, de like, as I see it miss, like, with these, like, wild punches, like, no, you got to try, like, round, like, pointing out tactical spots, like, try to smack them, like, with, with the height difference. Uh, I'm going to use Commanding Rally to make you... Uh, go again as a reaction. You can make another attack. Uh, you also get an extra oh, D8 okay. to your uh, roll. Uh, if the attack hits, the ally can roll D8 to add to the damage. Oh, okay, yeah, to the yeah to the damage. Okay, sweet. Yep. It is. <laughs> yeah, it, it's uh, yeah, directing like the idea of like a tactician style. I mean, as as a note, I'd just like to point oh, out, like thematically at least to me, it looks like Drez is just sort of just punching, like like soft hitting things, like as if he was yeah. a toy. But the actual impact is a lot more than it should be. Like yeah, this the, is... the idea that seeing the impact like doesn't make sense and realizing that this is actually like proper like strength behind it. It's yeah. almost that immediate like sort of lower defense, lower guard. Other things, nothing to like. Okay, then this thing actually might be helpful in some way. So it's just like. Yeah. A lot of people. As, He's holding coins in his hand. As Dritz knocks this guy out, you just hear coming from from him is like, "Sorry, kid, I'm just a cut above the rest." In a completely <laughs> different voice, I imagine. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that's my turn. <laughs> Number three. Amazing. It's amazing. One, two, three. It's out of the fog. Now go back into the entangled bitch, you no. won't. <laughs> Is it still a thing? Uh, a creature in the area with the spell cast is here. A creature restrained by plants. Is it DT otherwise? When the, when the spell into control chamber to work, okay. It's not DT? Uh, it's not instant get rid of dismissal, Three. but it no. is, uh, it is difficult terrain. That's what I have. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> right, he goes there. Um, that is his turn. Uh, yes, Mochi, you're up. Nessie's on deck. Well, we have this shit show below us. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Just web. Yeah. Fog cloud, entangle, web. No one can catch us. <laughs> it's safe. Oh, that's right, I shouldn't have my armor on. Wait, no, I was on watch. No, it makes sense, never mind. Yes, that's my work size. Okay. Uh, Casted the web. Fear nature, assholes. Uh, they fail. Hang on, it's not supposed to happen straight away. That's oh, all good. Yeah. It's all good. Just don't apply, <laughs> don't apply the effect and roll when it is the time. Yeah. Eh. Rip all fail. <laughs> Interaction. Yes, that is my act. Start to turn around. Not 
concentration almost got me. Oh. <laughs> yeah, no, I'll call that my turn. Okay. Trouble Warrior 1. Oh shit, they also have blindside. <laughs> Two, three, four, five. Get fucked. Fourteen. Alright, roll save on fourteen. Save on fourteen. Jeez, little one. He fails. Cool. Yeah. Strength. Alright, he'll use his action to try and break out. He's just save again, right? Uh, uh strength, strength check. DC. Strength check. Control. It is a failure. He's stuck. Number five. Ooh, did they step out of my range? Yep, they they did. They did. I don't I don't have disadvantage. <laughs> Is that a hit? hit? Oh. Screams in the fog. Ooh, shiny. Do nine damage. Uh, he then steps back. <laughs> Hi. That is a miss. Shapeless. Roll on shapeless. Just do the F run. Yep. Get rolled. He fails. He'll try and break out. Good. Yep. No way to keep restrained on. He's out. Yeah. We'll step up here. And uh, Nessie. Anyone got a uh, thumbs on deck? I'm in my fog. I can't see that. <laughs> Taking yourself with with them is uh, a strategy. <laughs> <laughs> that hit a choice. All of them? Uh, it hits nine sleazy and shapeless. Yeah. Uh, not That's sleazy. Not sleazy. Not fourteen. It's not exactly half. Yeah, that'll hit those three. Yep. That guy. And yourself. That's fine. Doesn't matter. Creep spell. Fuck, not a wizard. Gonna... I mean, it doesn't matter, there's muted thunder. Bonus action. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Bonus action, baby guns. Yep. Uh, <laughs> I forgot about that. Get that up, and then I'll just do the shadow on there. Okay. Don't even roll it on yourself, you're just immune. He's not. I'm not. The thunder? I the was... thunder damage. Yeah, I'm immune. Resistant? A gunshot I'm or immune. something backfiring. Uh, two, six, eight, one fail. Oh, so I take three I think fireworks. Yes. Uh, bang, they, bang. They all take, uh, five or ten damage. Roll your d20. Okay. That's action. Uh, action bonus action. Forgot about that. Yep. Thunder dragon. Am I? All right, calm down. Fireworks. Calm down. It's fucking March second. <laughs> what exactly is there to celebrate? <laughs> you know not celebrating. You not celebrating the lead up to Labor Day. You guys don't have Labor Day, oh. do you? Yeah. That's just us. No, Labor Day is just week. Well, th it's this week. For us this week. Labor Day is next. Wake off the next. Month. Yeah, ours is for some reason the week before. Four, no, five. not fun today. Stabbly Ab Mochi. That's a critical Stabbly Ab on Mochi. Can I see how far away? How far away are you? 25. I think I can 
within 30 feet. Yeah, I can, as a reaction, cause that crit to a normal hit. Okay. Just again, like, sort of, at that last minute, like, warning of just, like, duck the swing, like, just as it goes to swing at you. Make sure you take... Six damage, and you succeed on your concentration. Plum's turn. Smart action. Fifteen feet uh, to get up. Plum. Why is he restrained? Weird. Plum? Right. Just had, had a time. Plum is going to use. Is that triggering a lot for everyone? The fireworks. The fireworks? No. Okay. No. Stream. Let me know. Okay, maybe that. I don't know what the fuck that was. Okay, yeah, on, on stream you can hear it. Yeah. But not in Discord. Sorry, I can't do anything about it. I don't know what the fuck's happening. Just, just, just get fireworks. <laughs> you just get fireworks. Yeah, anyway, yeah, pump time. Yeah, uh... Oh, you don't have ice on. It's just ice that you have on. So uh, um... Either way. Uh... Is it pump on Yeah. Spell. Fifteen. I hope you. I'll be right back. I'm muting myself for the fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> Let me know if it's coming through my mic. It's not. I think Discord's fine. It's just that because stream, uh, micro doesn't have as much of a, a um, suppression oh, on it. Yeah. Cause like yeah, from sourced from him. Happy birthday. You moving my shit? Did you just want to put it where it was? Like, the exact square? I wouldn't put the square there, yeah. There so is so much going what on, on both What sides. does this spell do? Mine. Yeah, you can also delete the, uh, um, pedal the shadow. Uh, choose an unoccupied 15 foot cube of air that you can see within range. An element of force of whirling winds appears in that cube and lasts for the spell's duration. The cloud happily obscures its area. Any creature that enters the storm for the first time or starts its turn there makes a strength saving throw. If it fails, flame. I am back. Eggs. Uh, what did Plum do? Um, they're casting Petal Storm. Okay. Uh, Put that onto Petal Knight's list. Trees of Sanctuary Cube of Air can see within range of number to force the swirling winds and a creature that starts its turn. It's it is its turn. Just makes 34. Okay. Does this is do more damage and is bigger than than thing? And you then can maybe move it? no. It's it's for, it's 12 out of t instead of 20, but it is 30 feet instead of 20. No, I'm but talking the cloud of daggers. Oh. Uh, this is cloud yeah. of daggers, 15 foot version, plus more damage at the same spell. <laughs> Alright. Interesting. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Y'all wanna hear something real funny? What? I just had a fucking spider spook me. Oh. What? <laughs> did, he, did he say hi? He did. It's it's a much smaller one. I just didn't expect him to be on my bookshelf, which I'm right next to, and then he's like, hi, and it just jolted so, so yeah. me. <laughs> yeah. What you doing? Um, oh. I mean, they travel in pairs. It makes uh, sense that there's another one. If it helps Jeremy, it is also probably mm -hmm. the time of year because it's starting to get colder, meaning they're actually going to come indoors more. Oh, that's fine. I just wasn't expecting there to be I a big old spider. Like spiders, right so I just generally be careful this time of year. He's paying rent. It's a little Why did Shapeless die? Uh, uh, shadow. 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 Okay. Alright, cool. Uh, yeah, alright. Um,. Yeah, this guy will stab. It's apparently it's a music festival in oh, Caribbean shit, Gardens. <laughs> well, I can't see him now. <laughs> Hit. Let me do that. <laughs> Two damage. Tell me, please. He's paying rent. Twenty-eight. Roll on twenty-eight. 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 Get whipped. Uh, why is he? Dis but he was already technically restrained. Oh, okay. Uh, is he? Oh. Uh, he dropped the first 15. So that would have been a success. Right? Cool. Mm -hmm. Alright, so success. then... 
One, two, three. Stability have merch here. Can can he actually Get reach that? Because screen. the web is difficult to run. Uh, it was fifteen feet, so it'd have been enough. So what we just here? Mm-hmm. Uh ten, twenty, five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. Okay. Thirty, yeah. Uh hits. Stability add merch you damage for seven. Alright, succeeds. Thirty-two, I guess roll his five d four. Is five d four of what? Life damage. There is stuff there is stuff in it from yeah, from Tangle. Well you're also in a jungle. Oh, oh hang on. Oh yeah, hang on. That too. Uh, yeah, they need to make a strength save. Yeah, that's what sort I'm of saying, roll the roll the save. Is it start each time? Or the first uh, time? When the it first starts, turn there or it moves? Yeah. First time on a turn, all the start of his turn. Yeah, he succeeds. Yeah. Takes half. Or once once a turn. I believe it takes half. Plus another 2d4. I'm just gonna make a another damage. <laughs> just do 2d just do like 5d4 yeah. total. Because it doesn't matter if it's separated. Another two, three, yeah, two. Cool. Uh, let me mark that on this sheet. Did they not do damage? You target him. Yeah, okay, so eleven reduced to five. All right. Oh yeah, I didn't target. I just rolled damage. One, uh, one, two, three, four. Um, it's heavily obscured, so I'm not sure if you can see. You could see before, unlike everyone else couldn't see before. <laughs> There's a spell heavily obscures like foot cloud, cloud and daggers, but bigger. Does it say obscure? Beam. Yeah, this cloud heavily obscures this area. Concentration one minute. Interesting spell. Yeah. <laughs> Stab it up. It's in the first bracket. Hit Avon. Alright. Uh, Avon takes some damage. Initiative gets re rolled. Top of the order is. Avon! Drizz is under. Hey! Look at that. That plus <laughs> six is coming in handy. <laughs> uh. Hmm. That advantage for a virtue is not. No. Oh, wait, I rolled a natural 20. Pog. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna keep it simple and just attack the first person in front of me. Go ahead. Uh, do, 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 do. So, let the arrow attack. Mm -hmm. uh, that is a hit. Yep. Uh, that apply the. Oh, the Vegas branch is meant to go at the end of my next turn, I think. I, I, we set that up to, to work in a way. we did. But I guess we did. thought we did, because it was like... Dis this dis Don't worry. Yeah, I'm just going to put it back on me. It's fine, because I'm just going to need it. And... Boop! Why are you not rolling? I thought I put it on. Did it... It's an attack. Me not press it. It's not damage. Oh, I thought it was damage, my bad. Yes, my action? Uh, for my bonus action. Uh, my entangle is actually like here. Just so it's aware. I'm gonna keep it up. And I'm just gonna end my turn. Okay. Okay. Guard. Drizz, you're up. Plums on deck. Yep, alright. So, yeah, pummels that one with the assistance from Vaughn and, like, turns back to go and says, Hey, thanks for the help, Snuffles. And then walks mm. over to this one. <laughs> and go beat him up. Alright, um, just, yeah, happening. It's cool. That is a hit. Good. 
Do six damage. Alright, he's alive. Yep. Uh, go for, uh, yeah, bonus action, go for the old one two again. That hits. Yeah, some maxi kid. Love it. Still up. One more lock and down to have advantage. Each punch is accentuated by sword swings. Uh, that is a miss. That doesn't make sense. Ah, <sighs> okay. Uh, can I use my inspiration to draw it again? Why do you have inspiration? Apparently, I do. I was, I was looking at them like, did I get inspiration? It's on your sheet. I got, I got inspiration. inspiration. Did she not want for anything? Uh, maybe as, um... I think I, I've had it since the very beginning, I'm pretty sure. Oh, yes! You asked if Milton oh, crossed over. Yeah. Yes, go oh, ahead. Oh, carried over from Milton. Yeah, go ahead. If you yeah, want to, carried. go ahead. Oh, okay, okay. Alright, yep. Uh, yeah, I want to... <laughs> He's almost dead. Uh, you hit. Die. That's what now means. As he gets knocked out, you just hear, Your whip may be sharp, but my sword is sharper. How many did you written down? I haven't written any down. <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> I just think of them when I know something's gonna happen. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, unique. We'll go for a stab on the fish lady. Without advantage. Why advantage? Uh. Why are you prone? You shouldn't be prone. Doesn't say that she's prone. Doesn't. Name no. the or something. No, the practice test doesn't count. Game. The guy's dead. <laughs> Um, <laughs> still eat the yeah, second. dropped the second, so it still hits. They've pack tagged us, oh no. True damn. Richie, oh no. Oh dear, am I. Well, I'm, you're up. Oh, oh no, no. Ink's on deck. Uh, Plum Blossom. The best, the best cat. And I've lost going... roll two nat ones. Going mm, to use stars. their, um, oh. the feature known as Fiend Touched, and, uh, going to cast for free a Scorching Ray. Okay. I'm not gonna question what Fiend. It's a succubus. They are going to target... Just like you. Uh, <laughs> Tribal Warrior 28. Okay. So I was touched by a succubus? Yo? For Christine, we made that. Christine. Yeah, no! <laughs> this kind of thing. Miss. Oh, they roll a one. Travel kind Warrior, 28. That hits. Oh. Dead. That will target Travel Warrior 3 with their last one. That hits. Six damage. They will then use their bonus action to, I, I think, they... Mm? Uh, they're gonna... They're gonna do a... Use their bonus action to do nothing. Okay. And they're going to sit down politely and wait for them to die. Alright. Ink's turn. <laughs> Centers on deck. So, I would like to uh, whack this one with uh, the boomerang first. Go ahead. Like, basically just whack him with it, if that makes sense. Yep. Yeah. That is a hit. Yeah, now, just remind me, can I willingly drop concentration? Yep. Yeah. yeah. Not going to yet, but just, just curious. Um, as I will step up this way, uh, I think within ten feet on the grid, or am I off grid? You're on, the grid. on grid. Oh no, the one of the spells is off grid. That's what's happening. No, oh, I'm off grid. Okay, oh, yeah, they're within ten feet there, right? Yeah, cool. Um, as I will do the second boomerang uh, out of the fog at the first one. Oh wait, no, they're heavily obscured there as well. Aren't... No, they're blindsight, right? Yeah. Never mind. <laughs> it's like, wait. It doesn't matter. 
Yes. Um, yeah, okay, that hits. Huh. Mm. At which point, you know, sort of throw the boomerang as it comes back. Um, Ink basically drops the concentration on this and just shouts in Sylvan ominous background music. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Did they, they say the words ominous background music? Yes. Okay. <laughs> you, you're trying to imitate. <laughs> God damn it. That hits him. Hits the Mercury OP. Oh, he only takes three damage. Fourteen. Uh, is restrained, so he's gonna use. Chad strength to get out of this. Watch. Okay. 32. Uh, it's him. AJ, it's your turn again. No, it's my turn again. I'm just making sure where he was. So you attack him? Yeah. Damn. Cool. 8 damage. But what, if I wanted, what if I wanted to wild and bond? The bless is gone. <laughs> Center, you're up. Nessie's on deck. Alrighty, I'm going to move around here. Mm -hmm. Since you're, you're blessed and great. Primal savagery. Oh no. I don't like this bitch. Oh. Oh no. That's a crit. Oh, you certainly do. I'm committing a very angry murder. You do dead. He's dead. Oh jeez. Yep. She just bites into the dude's neck and rips it out. Just tears out the inside. Can I, as a reaction, just say tasty in, in Cinta's head? And I would like to say bonus action. Where are you? I want to throw a healing word over. You get a orb of vitae from that, don't you? Oh, yeah. You do. You nice. do. You got an orb of vitae. Hell yeah. Thank you. I wish I had those. <laughs> I don't I'm know how they work. Bonus action for a healing word over at Mochi. Hey, Maxil. It is appreciated. That is my turn. Travel Warrior 1 rolls his fucking terrible pedal dance ability from Pokemon made into a. <laughs> but doesn't confuse targets, so I don't exactly know how the dance set of this is. This, this is bullshit. Oh, uh, yeah, hang on. That's the um, the Kagebushi no Jutsu happens to him. What? Yeah, yes, that's what we said. Yeah, the, the Kagebushi no Jutsu. Why is it the Kagebushi no Jutsu? Do you know? Alright. He succeeds. Not half damage. Kagebushi no Jutsu. Did that roll half? Why did that not roll half? That doesn't look like half. What? Would be what eight? Yeah. Eight. Down. Could be the spell not set up correctly. Yeah, let's fix uh, that. Um. Oh. So just not hit if he succeeds. Is that yeah. the chance there? It's a it's a it's a hit or miss thing. Oh, that's uh, that's better. <laughs> All right. Yeah. He tanks it and then he. Um. Just like the real pedal dance. We'll, uh, oh, hi there. Stab at the fawn. I Why will interception if it hits. I mean, they did yell ominous background music, it's okay. Why <laughs> this? Because prone. Uh, that makes sense. Uh, so that's still the miss. That's all good. 30, okay. his turn. Make him roll the save. It's also strength, I guess, right? It's a strength save. Strength most, save, yeah. yeah. Most things can beat the strength save. Okay, him. cool. Oh. He will go... Ooh. Yep. Okay. Uh... Yes, he can only go there. He wants to be in the sandwich. <laughs> if he, he wants to escape him. the pedal attack, he can only do that, yeah. Um, yeah. He will attack with advantage on you, Avon. Yep. Can't, it's, That's it's a crit. That. I will. Uh, you know what? I'll actually wild and bomb this, causing the attack to miss. 
Okay. Uh, wait, wait a minute. Oh no, you did it. Yeah, don't worry. Don't worry, I'm good. No, I did because I was like, ooh, this is such a joke. Um, no, no, no. I, yeah, I, I, I saw something else last turn, but it's alright. Do you make sense yeah. last turn? Yeah, as it's like covered down, just like that pulse just comes through, just completely blocks like what would have been a fatal strike. Almost unintentionally. Like, Avon's not. Like, it wasn't Avon that did it willfully entirely. Uh, I now must make a charisma check. Mm -hmm. DC for the half the attack roll. I don't think I'm going to beat that. But... Yeah, DC is 12 then. Half the total attack was 12? Yeah. Oh. Well, damage or. No, uh, the roll, the two hit roll. Yeah, 23. Still fails. Uh, so the wild bombs disappeared at this point. Mm. But it did save me from a crit. So I yeah. cannot complain. Uh, Nessa, you're up. Mochi's on deck. Mochi, you knew you were on deck, right? Uh huh. <laughs> Bringing up the rear. Well, someone has advantage <laughs> on initiative. <laughs> you are pretty much always. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much always thing. Did you just get out of his range? I did. He okay. may attack me. He will. He will attack you, you silly little guy. That hits. That's a silly little guy attack. Take seven. I'm going to use my Heart of Chaos and Chaos Bolt. Okay. Yeah. Well, remember, well, remember, the crit doesn't crit like any other crit because it's not supposed to crit like any other crit. Like <laughs> that. Say it like that. That, that one? <laughs> that roll the damage separately. No, the damage crit. No, no, he can just roll the damage, it's just crit's different. He's dead. There's no, there's just no jumping around. Uh, it would have been... Auto-jumping that, yeah. yeah. It's 15. I would have made it. I, I would have made it fine. So... Yep. There's no kill like over kill. I uh, don't think there's a body there. Uh, I am pretty sure that's immediately turns to Ash. Roll your d20. Yeah, sure. Okay. Rolling your, yeah, rolling your thing. Roll the table. Yep. That's an nice d20. Anyway, roll it anyway. Yeah, roll it anyway. So, you know, sometimes I just don't have to ask him to roll, and I can make him roll next turn as well. Uh, all right. <laughs> okay. Me. Uh, I am going to the as a bonus action. Cut. Oh, yeah. Too bad now. Technically, your cantrips will be bonus actions. <laughs> I mean, I could chaos spell this as a bonus section. No, you can't. Already cast the spell. Two spells. Uh, well, then you know what? I'll give it a. Give me that. Give me that thing back. What? I'll give myself, I'll give myself my cards back. Okay. Yeah. I'm then gonna use my tides. Okay. Sorceress burst. All right. What is that? That's the target. 2024 shenanigans. All right. I'm gonna target tribal warrior. Thirty. Okay. Hey y'all. Um, it hits. It hurts. Uh, I'm going to decide that it is going to be psychic damage. Alright, you can roll another day roll again. on top. Oh. And then roll your tower again. <laughs> Why not? Spellcasting ability modifier. Wow, that's powerful. Well, that is arcane. I would like to reaction. I would have made that. <laughs> well, you have money. Did I have money? Oh wait, no, it's a cantrip. I did have money. Do you have money? Is it beneficial? <laughs> no. 
No, I, I I got 52 copper and I now got 43 gold. <laughs> you, you lost money, yeah. Yes. Huh. <laughs> yeah, Mochi, your turn. <laughs> I assume. It's my turn. You'd have a turn now. Fuck this nerd. Bonk. Okay. It's. I mean, you can move if you want, but. That's all you had left. Oh. You're dead. He is also pushed back 10 feet. He's dead. And Over pushed there. back. Grab him backwards. Were you doing your rapier You're stuff? Just 10 feet into the ground. No! I haven't attacked the same target twice. Fair enough. <laughs> I just haven't. They're just... Just... Oh! Del okay. I figured out why. There. Oh, my turn Okay. Uh, right, top of the order is... Ink Drop! Mochi's on deck. Hi! Yay. Uh... Well, see, I will not... <laughs> Fucking damn it. Uh, Knuckle Axe? Yeah, to go the ahead. Face. Face is good. It hits. For the ambush. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then, uh. Boomerang around the head. <laughs> As I basically. It's like not quite in one hand and using the boomerang like a melee weapon. That one's a miss. That is a miss, too. Um, and then, uh, do I have a reaction or anything? No, uh, moving on, Mochi? Yeah, Mochi, you're up. Palms on deck. It's my turn. This dude in this web is the safest out of everyone else, because yeah. he's so healthy. He hasn't hulked out yet. I'm gonna move here. <laughs> you know what I'm gonna do? Right. Stab. It hits. Ten. That's it. Alright. Thirty. And yeah, we'll continue his assault on the rabbit. Which is technically an assault on two fronts. That's a crit. What the fuck? I, <laughs> I don't have my reaction. <laughs> uh, can I reaction to learn whatever spell they're using? <laughs> Uh, you do uh, the six damage. Plum. I'm not next to center. Center's on deck. Plum will use his bonus action to move the square. Plum. I will, I will just spell it at this point then. Huh? No, yeah, this is bonus action. Alright. Oh, don't put a bun in it. Oh, have to. I don't know, let him cook. If I let him cook, let me think about this for a second. Please, uh, strength semi pray, you say? I was gonna say, you could just move it over yeah, slightly. Yeah, it'll just go there. It'll go there. 30's on critical. I will. That is his bonus action. Mm hmm. Uh, get it. It technically entered its zone there, right? No, it does it on its turn. turn. Okay, yeah. Well, like Moonbeam. Uh, he'll then, as an action, uh, light that bitch 30 on fire. Okay. Uh, hiya. It's a. Failure. He's dead. He then goes back to sleep. Okay. He's, 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 he's <laughs> sleeping. He's he's light enough. You can just say rest. He closes his eyes. 
I mean, you still get one. You just use your bonus action. Remember? Yeah, I know. Suck up the blood. I want to kill him. <laughs> yeah, okay. Just go down and suck up the blood. Just click, click. Slip, slip, just slip. suck it yeah. and then action kill this guy and then get two. Slip, 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 slip. Yeah, but I can only hold two. Yeah, but you empower, oh. you empower the attack that you're gonna get, right? Because then you would have two. And then you get another orb. You're right, you're right, you're right. Yeah, I'm gonna slurp up this boy. That's not fair. <laughs> Um, Primal yeah. savagery, smack him with an empowerment. Yeah. Empower? I got one on myself, yep, cool up here. And then, I'm a bite! Yep. What does an empowerment of that look like? The... So like, the, I guess her fangs would increase and then they'd just okay. get like, red. <laughs> Initially, she has like her normal, slightly bigger thing for being a Kimbadria, and then when she uses the Primal Savory, kind of just some blood comes down and sort of makes them a bit longer. And now they're like much longer, like a saber tooth, because they're still like, sticking out. She bites into this guy's neck. He's not dumb. Oh. <laughs> I'm into it. I kind of like it. Still up. <laughs> <laughs> this man. Somehow. He's not going to hulk out of this, he's just going to throw the fucking thing. <laughs> he still hits. <laughs> what? <laughs> Through his spear. Through his spear. Oh. <laughs> well. No, you know if that made him drop concentration. Let's see, you're up the bonds on deck. <laughs> okay, as a bonus action, because all my spells were casting times of one action have a mm -hmm. bonus action here. Yes. Um, I can only cast one spell a turn. Uh, you could only do anyway. Yeah. Uh, Chaos Bolt. Alright. Not just quick and spell, make it free action. <laughs> <laughs> no, Nessie knows that it, 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 has, it has to go this way. Nice. That's a miss. I'm gonna use fortune spells to do that. Okay. Dice, dice, dice. It's like a lucky spell. Uh. It's a. Uh, 6, 18 hits. Yeah, yeah. Uh. And. 2d8. It's very important that I roll this. Okay. Yep. <laughs> it seems like overkill. Um, then, as an action... Roll your tower. Uh, roll on your... Your thing. <laughs> your, roll your... Roll your, roll your d20. That's all your thing! Right. Get a one. Fuck. Alright, roll your tower. You just wants to get it for oh, free, yeah, so you can right. hold the other one just, for later. You just want me to fireball myself, don't you? Absolutely. I mean, so badly. I mean, if we're doing hardcore mode, I think this is hardcore enough. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Go Big, like fish. Big fish. <laughs> Best Karen's eating good tonight. Now we need two more in line. <laughs> this happens right. This happens yeah, right in front of Drift. Right we could have made quite a meal out of Nessie right now. We could. We really could. If you eat enlarged me after the minute, does it then reduce its calories? Yep. Uh, use the Hanyo mutation. Mm -hmm. uh, suppressing thoughts, uh, and Trouble Warrior must make intelligence saving throw. He's pretty good. Succeeds. Fail. Oh. Uh, Man's a like scholar. To roll that with inspiration. Can we see into that place, or...? It's heavily obscured. Okay, yeah, just but curious. he moved out of the thing. And then you put it back on top. Yeah, I would have seen it. Yeah. I don't. I don't is do you have to say the creature? It is a have to say the creature. Then then you can't do it. Uh, I don't do that. If it doesn't if it doesn't say you have to see a creature, then it's fine. If you know a creature is there and it doesn't mention being able to see him or not, then go ahead. But it mentions being able to see him. So, 
Just get Rathblim's second to... glance. You didn't have to say that. Uh, as using my meta magic, I'm going to spend two sorcery points to love when spell <laughs> to make it action. <laughs> Actually, make sure you're saying what you need to say. I don't know what you were doing. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's right. I, I... No, I can't even finger guns. I have to say, yeah, I'm done. I'm okay. done. I'm, I'm, I'm saying. All right, Ivan, you're up. Triss is on deck. <laughs> This is going to be a difficult turn as I press this button, and then after that button, I do nothing. It doesn't miss. It's a difficult turn, I tell you. <laughs> Alright, this man's turn. Will he get out of the Kage Bushin, I guess? Or, you know, turtle dance? Pokemon. Kage Bushin. <laughs> Kage Bushin and Trisha doesn't do this! <laughs> he fails. He's dead. He had one HP. No! <laughs> Kage Bushin and Trisha! Quick, take up the orb! I will inform- That was all best rights to happen! I was gonna say, I will inform Center immediately via reaction that the target in front just dropped. Oh, neat. I will slip. Yep. Slip. You slip. Close up. Yes. Just, just see- <laughs> Yeah, you see a crew entire size larger and just like, WHAT THE FUCK?! <laughs> And then runs over this way. Yeah. If, like if there's anything I felt like I've seen, it would have been like magic spontaneously doing random things. So I feel like that, that would probably be a bit unfazing. Okay. One by transfusion for me, and I went to say Sinter Von. I. HP each. The. Uh, cool, I'll take three from that. Ink wonder. Did anyone need health? Also, this is probably when Driz notices the, the sort of connection healy thing by looking in the direction when this happens. Oh, so only like a health, please. So only two hours of your long rest will have passed at this point, so resetting is only going to be an extra two hours. Yeah, which we, we would do anyway. Yeah. I'm just letting you know. Ah, I'm still going to give one heal to this uh, fish. Signal that. Whoops, I accidentally held down the button and it, my mouse double clicked. Uh, it's just the first one for between me and Us. Yvonne. Yep. So six. Oh, not six each. The second oh. one was not meant to happen. Uh, mm -hmm. one was 11. One, and five. Okay, cool. And looking around, is anyone else still mildly injured? We're good. Uh, I'm good. Whoops, I just killed myself by accident. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> I'm bad. I gave myself 56 wounds. Alright guys, blood me. Uh, I'm, I'm, oh no wait, they're down! <laughs> I'm on the floor, you just watch me fall over randomly. It's fine. Quick, suck up the blood. It's okay, I can see you collapse with my eyes closed. As Driz runs up, as the battle seems to fade, a legally distinct version of the Final Fantasy victory sound appears. <laughs> da, 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 da. That works. Yep. Yep, that's it. What's so out of tune? It's quite legally distinct. <laughs> Very legally distinct. <laughs> so distinct that it may as well be its own creation. You know what, just for that I'm a time hot three turns. Yeah, you should. As a minute passes, um yeah, Nessie shrinks down. The magic's the wave seems to flow into her Nessie normally this time. And yeah, yeah, I think I'm gonna stick by this thing that wild magic just seems normal to me. Like, with what probably sort of background and all that with Yo, who knows what magic kind of manipulation. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, we, we, we're probably just like the most normal, just still on guard to like any spontaneous combustions. <laughs> and I must pick up my child. <laughs> Make a drizzle like appropriately you, small. I, I like how you've actually made them appropriately small. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I just noticed that. I forgot to do it at the start of the fight. That's fine. Uh, I need Yvonne. to make Driz a girlfriend. Yvonne, did you say the whole seeing wild magic thing out loud, or is that just uh, thoughts? Uh, mostly thoughts, but 
I mean, if you're still connected, we could make it that sort of thing where it's. Maybe, no, uh, no, if you can say that, that, that's fine. Just very quickly. I'll just say, like, in terms of like reaction for like, especially like something like this happening, like where it just grows in size, Avon's just not phased. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, we're, we're... <laughs> just trying to remember how it would work if I tried to heal one of you. I think it's, it's half split. Each, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it would yeah. split. Just roll it into the board. Yeah, roll in, and then we'll sort it out. We are very weird. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out who might still. Nah, everyone's light. We're pretty good. Like, I've got only five wounds. I've got six. Yeah, so, yeah, no if, you manage to heal, if you manage to heal <laughs> ten, it basically get us both to max. You know what? Let's see. Done. Uh, you want to uh, you want to take the four? I I'll take the three. Yeah. Yeah. Not quite I give myself twelve. Yeah, it's like, who do I, you know, trying to figure out which one of you to keep in So the idea is like, say you, like you don't know at first, but you like end up like going to Sinta. As soon as you like let that healing magic sort of wash over, mm -hmm. that just like thin ethereal line just like sort oh, of Oh no, I, like out of character, absolutely I understand it, but it's yeah. like... <laughs> yeah, I know, that, that, that's what you sort of see when you do heal Sinta, mm. like you choose to heal Sinta maybe. It like... touches both. <laughs> at the same time. Yeah, it's almost like that ethereal like line that connects them. It's like almost attached to them, like their persons. On the plus Unlike... side, I oh, yeah? would say being so close, you would actually see how ink uses their magic, and you notice as uh, one of the spellbangers disappears from their finger. Ooh. But yeah, uh, another thing to note as well, this is unlike the Wylan Bond, where it's like more of like a bubble that is always around hmm. the two of them when it's active. This one, like this line, like connecting them is directly to them like it is attached to them whether it be like near near the chest near the arm depending on which the other person picks uh mine is probably more on the uh right hand area <laughs> left hand sorry Missed imagine for right center it's like over where her heart would be yeah <laughs> like around like the left arm and hand yeah, I'll be honest, the only reason I don't, like, have to connect to Mochi as much is just having traveled with them for a bit, it's like, I know what they're capable of. Mm. So connecting the others is a way to learn. Yes. I'm back. Welcome, Welcome back. back. We've just shared intimate details. Lore. Okay. Taking yeah, a long no, rest. Like, noticing... Yeah, we'll take a long rest for a bit. Go on. I was gonna say, like, noticing, like, the sort of way, like, how this energy just sort of dissipates from your hand as you're casting the spell. Like, there is, like, a curious, inquisitive look to it, like, want, like sort of wondering how it works, and then I guess, like, if that is noticed, uh, Avon will probably just say, uh, um, strange, that's probably one of the few types of magic I've not seen. Explain later. She was just not, yeah, she's gotten at least a little bit of trust to you to sort of let it go for now. They're at least trying to use the common tongue. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Tiny bit. Especially when you're using common, like, there's just that knowing not it doesn't continue on, not wanting you to kind of stress yourself. Mm. She's not understanding. I figured it's probably easier if I actually try to have the character speak once in a while rather than just mental all the time. Yeah, do either. That's ominous background music. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, just like kind of, I guess, cleaning up things before preparing again for oh. the long rest. I, d I don't think... How late is it? Pretty late, right? Yeah, it's like midnight. Yeah, probably too late to actually travel on like last. So... Unless, like, there are other people bringing up ideas, Yvonne would probably, like, say to just, we'll have to just stick it out and just be a bit more vigilant. Mm -hmm. Better that than traversing the jungle at night. It's the last thing I feel like we should be doing. And yeah, Kabon will put effort into actually like, move the bodies, like, unceremoniously, like, away. Yep. Just... Yeah, like, no kind of emotion to it, it's just moving an object from A to B. Uh, yeah, I think we'll help with that. Trying to 
picking up. You're just trying to move them, I guess. Yep. I imagine a bit of time as well, like I mean, half an hour or so, is just like to kind of put them near a bunch of foliage. Just so it's kind of masks the smell with a bit of nature, like not just like out straight in the open, but just some nature is covering it a bit. <laughs> but that's really about it. Just like trying to move and trying to like just cover, bury whatever the bodies. Not really like caring which way around it happens, just doing whatever makes the most sense at the time. And then back to the long rest. Cool. Have your two rolls. Uh, yep. Oh, oh. We're getting close every time. <laughs> Maybe we should expand the range. Something happened to you soon. I should expand the range. Yeah, if we roll a one, bad things happen. Oh. As you so, all okay. get a long rest, apologies. Please apologize for me. No. Okay. Yes, you all wake up and prepare another day of survival. Quickly do the leather. There's no rain. What's the forecast today? It is quite, uh, quite colder than normal. It is pretty temperate. Like mm. 15 degrees, maybe. 15, 20 degrees. What well, we're looking at Kelvin, though. I don't, I don't remember the math for Kelvin. <laughs> and it is a no ring. Comfortable warm day. And it is what? 15 degrees. No word. Hell yeah. Yeah, it's the cool temperature of 15. As you all uh, get ready, we'll have your survival rolls. Don't worry, I do the best of these at the worst of times, so... Is it time for us to switch leader? He's been doing great! I will definitely help. I don't think Moshi's done anything wrong in terms of rolls. Even if it happened to be a one, and still managed to get up we... the track. We need a. If we change, then we have to be punished. Lamanessu. I'm I'm just gonna let him fail first, and then we'll swap. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, are you going fast or slow? Oh, normal. Wait, you Uh, we're gonna go normal today. All right. Uh, add a nothing. Just nothing. Just a nothing. Just roll your die. Be Just cool, do you, dude. buddy. 23. Alright, where are you going? Look at your guy. Guess uh, diagonal left? Down? Yeah, to, to this one. Okay. May as well. It's that, I mean, if we keep following those tiles, we get close to it. Mm -hmm. Even if we fuck up, at least we don't go too far over into the wrong way. Yeah, because there's, there's a river. <laughs> we can't cross that. Cool. We're starting to get to mountain there, actually. So you make your way oh. across yeah, the forest. The um, seems pretty chill. Seems pretty good. Normal day ahead. I hate that. As it is the 11th now, right? Yes. Yes. Sure. So then, yeah, next day will be the 12th. All right. So you all go for your sleep. So let's have your perception check go. Hey. Okay, twelve and fourteen. That's better. I need to get more fucking new yeah, music in this playlist because it's just really good. <laughs> hmm. Oh, and maybe we're trying new eyes tonight. Do you want my um? <laughs> yeah, do, do you want to play my eyes tonight? <laughs> what is that like? Hmm? You're just like having a face in your chest as you're holding me. Uh, your blind sight? Oh, I said, did they want to borrow my blind sight? <laughs> okay. <laughs> you took your buttons off and you forgot to put them back on to watch. Uh, <laughs> Center? Or are you sleeping today? <laughs> Center rolled a nine. Yeah, oh, my bad. Nine. My bad. Yeah. Um, yeah, as you all 
go to sleep. Nothing seems to approach me in the night, even though Driz is looking in a puddle that's reflecting just enough for him to see himself. He's spending too much time with that puddle. I'm not enjoying like, it. <laughs> it was like a tiny bit of one, and I, I like fell over and I'm just like facing the ground. <laughs> fell into the puddle. <laughs> <laughs> As... You've been somehow pulled into center shirts. As there is now a second <laughs> second day, let's go. It's the twelfth. Uh Ink would propose a question first thing in the morning. Yeah. Speaking through Avone. Mm -hmm. Can you ask the others if any of you would like a tattoo on these travels? I have a few designs I can do. Just cosmetical, are you looking at? Like, noticing, like, again, more look towards your fingers where those spells may have how it was, like, tattooed, like, but it disappeared. I think, like, what I have up here taps the side of the head. Where's that the tattoo is? Hmm, <laughs> proper tattoo. I see. I mean, sure, uh, I'm, I'm sure it might depend on who... I, I don't know if I might need something like that, personally, but I can ask if that others wish to. It could mm -hmm. be useful, having these kinds of communications. Like, it could allow us to be at range and be quiet. Yeah, um... She, she's under the assumption that it's only the head one. Because that's what you've said so far. Mm -hmm. Hasn't but specified. She... Uh, they yeah. did say a few designs, but that wasn't yeah, exactly. really specific. It, it, she gets the idea that there might be something else, but not entirely sure if that's the only thing, so she's not going to like assume otherwise. And yeah, just we'll go around to one by one, just say like, the same sort of like, thing to each one's like, uh, Inkdrop said she, uh, they might have something that could be of help magical wise with tattoo uh not sure how it works not sure what it does entirely but potential of use and it's just like that same thing to just everyone mm -hmm. i imagine driz hears it through center because it's just sort of like they say the same area yeah like you're, you're talking to center but driz is also there to hear it yeah She's just kind of at this point, just not properly uh, looking for Jizz and just full attention to Sinta. <laughs> eh, not so long. Box game check for. I mean, I've, my skin still needs to be changed anyway, so I guess if I get it now, then when it gets replaced, it'll be gone anyway. So, uh... Oh, if only it was that simple. <laughs> maybe, maybe. I'll see. I'll see what she's got. You, you know, so I'll just kind of... You want me to do such a... Uh, sure. Go for it. Because yeah, he's, yeah, he's talking to... Yes. 16. Uh... I wouldn't say frustration is the right word. But when you speak, there is that kind of like... Okay, like... A, like that sort of... Slight irritation? But you don't expect it to be directly to you. <laughs> like, it's not purely just because you're speaking. Okay, that's, yeah. That's probably the best way to describe it. Yeah, that's probably the best way to describe it. And then, she, like, after that, I imagine, like, uh, she just de uh, declines that sort of thing and then goes back to what she was doing and then just Devon just waits a little bit and then goes off back to helping because that's all she can, she can do right now. <laughs> But the survival stuff. But yeah, so hands so just cover kind of, like I pick up that like you you get annoyed like 
uh, uh, when I talk, you're not just like you don't seem annoyed by default. Yes, and you can probably with a yeah. sixteen at least tell that like, it is yeah, not purely direct. Like there, there is something else there. It's like she was. It's like she was focused on sensor talking to her, you speak, and then there's like that little turn to look like at you, that sort of. Mm -hmm little annoyance before turning back to center and then like being a bit more softer well, that's it okay yeah i'll go back to ink drop uh they uh thumb said they were fine with it but uh i know that center said that she didn't wish to the, mm. the toy doesn't know how that would work, understandably, but the others haven't given me a, a full question just yet. They that might come is to you. okay. The important part is, even if you lose the limb, the tattoo stays. Ominous. <laughs> it's that sort of thing where it's like... Ominous background music. <laughs> That that wasn't that wasn't a threat, but it also wasn't <laughs> like kind. It wasn't encouraging. <laughs> Is it something I thought said? Ah, uh, no, no. It just it's all right. It's fine. But uh, yeah, just kind of uh, after that goes back to help uh, Mochi with direction and stuff with the map and her navigational skills. I fucking smile as I look up to it on my fucking picture. <laughs> <laughs> it's just so. <laughs> it won't hurt you. It won't hurt. I think. That's everything, then we'll have the, the survivals for the day. <laughs> Sorry, I'm gonna have the double click thing again. Yes, yeah, nice eight. And what are we doing today, Mr. Man, Mr. Leader Jude? The bosser. What's the, what's the number? Are you doing fast, normal, oh. slow? We'll go fast today. Okay, minus five, plus well, minus four, minus five, minus six, minus five, minus four, minus three. Not minus six. Okay, and your d4? No. Oh. Alright, you still only move one smile, one tie out today, but you do know where you're going. Yeah, um, as you're traveling in the morning, uh, your group sees a group of, um, a group of six of these orange koala bear things, uh, on these large, uh, trees that seem to have an enormous amount of fruit on them. They're climbing it? Sorry? They're just, they're just hanging out on these trees. 
History. History? Mm, uh, not no. I'm gonna go nature. Mm -hmm. On the logic that they remind me of monkeys in the Feywild. <laughs> yeah. Well, um. I will let you roll to identify these creatures. Is that what you're trying to do, or...? Uh, more I'm trying to... Uh, so Inkdrop is more thinking whether they look like the way they're doing things. It's better to avoid them. The nature they're giving okay, off. Yeah. I suppose that'd be more insight, wouldn't yeah, it? Yeah, go mm -hmm. ahead. Uh, yeah, that's probably an insight track. Go on an I, I will take the track. insightful route, because I would not know anything about it. <laughs> yeah, no. Hmm, this is some animals. Insight. So they look threatening when we get closer. As you get closer, they all start to... <laughs> okay, well, and they all bare their teeth, and they all, like, grip onto the tree, uh, causing some of the wood to get clawed out. What did they call just like? Those little, like, orange koala bears. Oh, drop bears are real. <laughs> Avoid. <laughs> <laughs> Should I fog cloud and move back up? I think we just back up first, and if we notice one missing suddenly, fog cloud. <laughs> it's okay, we can rebuild fog. Yeah, maybe we can just throw him into the that. Anyone got pending? <laughs> uh, no. Oh, shame. Tris, kill them all. <laughs> Yvonne gets <laughs> super rude. <laughs> Yeah, you all seemingly just step away from the trees and yeah. continue your trek. <laughs> Maybe that, that fruit was really good fruit. I'm just saying, we could have, if Milton was here, bless his soul, we could have made a good meal out of it. <laughs> You're right, Milton's cookbook. Fruit and the monkeys. Does Milton's cookbook contain a recipe for fruit? Yeah, yeah that's the exact description. But, um... There's a bunch, yeah. It's a cool. shame it turned into a potato. No, 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 no. no that's right. No, no it was, um... The diary. I, oh. it was, I think it was Milton's journal. Yeah. They have the cookbook. You could yeah. Reference uh, the cookbook. That's what I was doing. Um, <laughs> yeah, sorry, I forgot about the cookbook. Did you see some of the things? Uh, you noticed that they are yucca fruit on these. Waka? Waka. You Waka, waka. Oh, no, waka. Nomi nomi. Waka waka hi. Are you talking Crash hi. Bandicoot? No, that's Uka. Uh, no, that's, that's Uka Uka. That's Wimper. Wimper, yeah. This Jambalaya. Uh, yeah, you see. right. Uh, let me just see. If I have some Wampa fruit? Yuka grows on the ground. But they're not Yuka, they're Waka. It's entirely different. <laughs> just said that. <laughs> legally distinct. Legally just, distinct yucca. I don't think this even is a legally distinct thing. I think it's just a different plan. When did we go to Final <laughs> Fantasy? Yesterday. When you when it went to Chult, apparently. Um, they are. I apologize. They're not fruits. They are. the like oh. fist sized nut clusters. Oh. Damn it, can't chop them up. And they look like coconuts. Coconut, coconut. Mango. Yeah, but you all avoid. Yeah, they'll still avoid. Nothing interesting to me. <laughs> As you all uh, continue, make your way uh, to a place of rest where nothing seems to happen uh, during your travels there. Ah, oh, the travel, the, the rest. Ambush, straight away. Who knows? I don't like that. So you all go to sleep for all your perceptioners. Yeah, that love makes sense. I'm just um, wondering what those nuts yeah. were, and if they were really worth it. They probably weren't. If, if I'm nothing on high happens. Alert tonight. Those beasts hmm? could be behind us. What were you saying, Rebecca? If nothing happens, if nothing happens during the night, du while uh, if Vaughn's on watch and Sinter's asleep, I want to have a chat with her. Okay. 
Yeah. Um, just one more from Nessie and or uh, thing. Oh, right. Yeah, as your night goes on, uh, seemingly in the middle of the night, um, Drez sort of gets out of like a, a, a death grip of Cinder hugging him while she sleeps and makes his way over to you, Yvonne. Yep, I think my one I said was just the second half of ours, so it'd be late into the night. Just, yeah, just I, I think it's that sort of thing where it's like it's still to me is just a magical puppet. So I, I'm mostly looking down, waiting to see what happens first, instead of being like like hello and all that sort of stuff. Ah, uh, hey, yeah. Look, all right. Look, I know we may have gotten off on the wrong foot, but your uh, your foxy friend is doing me a, a great favor, and I'm I'm at least indebted to them. Right so I'm here to, you know, help thieves. Oh, no, 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 it's some... Um, I don't know what, what you, you're... Uh, I don't, I don't know what you're thinking, but it's, it's fine, it's fine. I mean, I could have been mistaken, but you seemed a little miffed by my presence. Hmm, what was your response to you let be? No, no, I don't... No, I don't think that... You might... have just missed something. I... I don't believe that. That's exactly... Like, what she is doing is been helping you, and that's really good. I... If, yeah. Yeah, it checks out. Women I mean, 8, like, you can probably just be like, I mean, like, there's nothing really saying, like, that she disbelieves what she said. I mean, everything that, like, every time you see her talk to Sinta, it's that kind of, like, honesty, and when she t talks about her, it is that same honesty. So, you wouldn't expect anything of those words to hint at something, particularly. It's like, yeah, she thinks like she is doing a good job and she thinks it is good, but you can't really get anything else. Alright, well, so long as there's no bad blood between us, Snuffles. I... I don't know how I feel about that, though. <laughs> hmm? I don't like the name. My name's Avon. Ah! Right, sorry. Alright, Yvonne then. You see, for a moment, she just kind of is still, like, in that kind of inquisitive, like, staring in that aspect. And it's just a moment where it's just, like, nothing. And the silence just breaks from her. It's just like... What even are you? Like... Is this... A person, or is this more of a contraption from an, like, an artificer? Uh, I mean, I wasn't anyone before I was this. And yeah, uh, I wouldn't necessarily call him an artificer, but he was a crafter of sorts. I don't even know if he did it intentionally. He uh, just wanted a, someone for his little girl, and I've been with her since. I was nothing, and then I woke And you're just... How did you even gain the knowledge of who you're mimicking is then? If you just wake up. Oh, Dress. Uh, wait, hang on. Uh, I need to find thing. Uh, where is it? Oh, fuck, fuck. 
Can I pull out a gun? Do you got free yeah. guns in there? It could be hiding that in there. Stop asking oh. questions, Essie. <laughs> You're asking too many questions here. Yeah. Alright, oh, okay. Alright, we see little uh, sweet Maria, who I was made for. She absolutely loved dri drips. She's got all, all the books, play, plays at him all the time. Right. I think. And her, her dad just wanted her to have a. little drips of her own. I mean, others came afterwards, but I was the first one. Wait, so there were more like you running around? Uh, oh, oh, no, no, he didn't make none like me, just ones he bought. I see. You know, proper ones. Sorry, I'm still... I feel like for, like, a lot of this is just, like, she's trying to rack her head around it because this doesn't sound like a Warforged for one. Like, this is not a Warforged, there are no directives, there's no nothing. This doesn't sound like something that would be similar to, like, a Soul Cage, in, like, situation. Like, this doesn't... That, 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 like, that Maybe it could be, maybe not, but it's not hitting the same beats. Um, and it's just, yeah, one of those, like, she's bewildered at how this thing ex not exists, like, because magic, of course, yada yada, <laughs> but, like, how it has so much free will is like the interesting thing to her um and it's just it's, it's that kind of little bit of fascination that does kind of drop the guard a bit like in the sense of like there there is like if there was any hidden malice there is none like sort of situation yeah it's like i, I don't know how it works i just i just know that i'm here and you just woke up as you were, not in a particular place or facility. Just well, nothing. I no, I. My first memory. Yes. First memory is what? Sorry. Hmm? First memory is what? Sorry. Is is what? Sorry. Your first memory is what? Sorry. Oh, didn't hear. Uh, he said, uh, uh, being on his desk. And, yeah, she's just in confusion. Like, but probably under, a bit under her breath. Like, you, you probably hear because you're, like, you're close enough. And she, again, still doesn't <laughs> see as a thing. Uh, she's under her breath. She's like, not from facility. Not anything directive to have such a thing like that and that free will it's from the get-go instead of having to fight for it she just ponders just in thought Whether or not you break the silence, that is entirely up to you. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, he I mean, yeah, already said that. Yeah, he doesn't really get it. What's he just going uh, hmm? Late. Like, in the probably second half of the entire watch. Okay. Sorry, continue, Rebecca. Yeah, we'll be explaining. Anyway, uh, I should get back. And he'll go back to the center and just, like, wiggle his way back into her arms. <laughs> Thank you for seeing that. There's, like, that little bit of, like, mm. but that's it. Yeah? Yeah, I'll just continue my watch. As Matt persists, so we'll have your check. I think we oh, did, did ours. Yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm, I want. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Alright, your next day. 
everyone gets up and we get our survival going. The weather, uh, it seems to just have no wind, no rain, and pretty normal. Charge, are we going fast, slow, or normal? Fast. Right. High knees, high knees. Uh, none, <laughs> just a flat minus five. Minus five. Hey, we got a zero. Alright, we didn't make it worse. Oh, but he, but so he did. Worse. Anyone got an inspiration? I think we're already out of inspiration. Nah, no, no, it's fine. fine. Alright, roll your day four. Don't you get an inspiration for that? Oh, yeah, uh, you do. Oh, he should have. He should have had an inspiration <laughs> for the last one. You do get inspiration for that too. All right. Uh, Please don't take us back. Uh -oh, <laughs> Please. We're gonna need more ration. Okay. Oh, well, you've got good berry. I don't think you. Berry. I don't think you've been needing to take off rations for a while. Oh, I have not been this whole time. I, th this session, I've not been because. It, that was when Plum decided to do a good berry for his last session. As you casually give myself five more rations back. As you for that. <laughs> continue to the trek, you seem to be in the in the thick of the jungle. You don't necessarily know where you are. Um, unless you want to try at one point to figure out. Sure. How do I go about doing that? Um, How confident do you feel? <laughs> pretty confident. That's. So uh, we'll say a survival or a yeah, I guess survival. I'm so navigating, so I want to jump uh, in on this roll as well. Is, is it clear that we're lost? <laughs> Probably not. Let me just see if I have anything that helps me along. Would I be able to use my proficiency with guidance, navigations tools to have, have some guidance this. for this yeah this is just a this is just a straight up just seeing if what direction you went in okay have some guidance yeah. uh, with a 23 you seem to have traveled north oh. just now start oh. going the other direction just but only direction. but only one time yeah um so do we see the river you probably not. Not not today, no. Okay. Cool. And your day goes without much hassle other than the the travel going north, at which point one of you probably notices Mochi <laughs> like just stops the group while they're on break, has a look at like stuff while he's eating. <laughs> just a little. Mm. <laughs> I like to think. I like to think I'm also like there as he's like, like going back through it, and then I'm just like kind of going through the path that we took, like with using like a blank sheet for like, uh, topography school, uh, topog whatever. Kit, yeah. Uh, yeah, like and realizing that there was a mistake somewhere. <laughs> as he, like, I want to know. As well. In this game, how are you supposed to get from all the way up here to all the way down there and not die? <laughs> Good question. Well, the thing is, usually, um, usually it's just one guy making one trek uh, without the modifiers, but we're doing it this system as well. Yeah. So, but even then, I've wow. raised I've raised the DC of what uh, the check is should be, uh. and I even reduced it from what I had of that. <laughs> so initially which is fair also, uh, maybe like, it's usually dc 10 and i was like and i was like oh everyone's pretty good at survival except like one It'll or two people so I, I was like i was like yeah i'll have like a dc 17 with um, everyone rolling with everyone rolling and then i was like that's, Realize little, how that's that too rough good. and then i've changed it to a lower <laughs> number which i will not tell you <laughs> it might be 15 <laughs> Could be longer than that. Ooh! It might be seven! I reckon it's a thirteen. Um, I yeah. fourteen. As your travel is, uh, your travel is unimpeded by anything. We can 
have your perception checks for the evening. Are we supposed to level up at the end of this, aren't we? No. Is it right? Yeah, yeah, level, four sessions? Level yeah, four sessions. You last time. Since you're level four. <laughs> no, it's uh, three Wait. sessions after you're level four. So once you hit to fifth, then we'll increase oh, to... Oh, we just leveled up. I forgot. Yeah. My bad. Yeah, because yeah. you leveled up last session. I totally forgot. This is it. This is session one of three. Remember your multi-class? No. Yeah, neither. I've yeah. got a single warlock thing here. <laughs> This is session one of three. Uh, when we hit three of three, we'll go to four. Uh, we'll go to five, and then it'll be four. After uh, when we hit, yeah, five is the next proficiency bonus. So yeah, then we'll go to four. Four streams of level per level. So, which uh, we might not have anymore. Oh no, we we'll, we'll get one more. Uh, we'll get the 30th, if, if, and then if we're not doing broad, which I think we are, I think I got it. Uh, do, we'll I have, do I have answers from everyone about that yet? Uh, maybe not me, but I mean, I'm down for it, and down for less, it it's like you don't want people to miss out on D&D, in which case I'm have to do either. As a, as a discussion for the group, I think I've only got one from Dimming, okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll figure it out later. Um, but yeah, there's not going to be another one of these in two weeks because the painter is supposedly going to be in my room by that time. Okay. And yeah, whole house is getting painted. I'm getting the purple feature corner. Nice. I'm also getting the purple. Mm. Nice. So, uh, yeah. So I'm hopefully we get... I mean, hopefully we're back by the Saturday, but I doubt it. I think they're going to be starting, like, Tuesday, Wednesday. Yeah, and it's a nice dark purple. Well, not a dark purple, but, like, a darkish purple. But, yeah. Anyway, more or less about my room, more about what happened during the night, which is nothing. <laughs> Who would have guessed? And uh, tomorrow is same as today. Normal weather, normal rain, normal. Uh, just normal. Normal wind. Just a typical day. <laughs> In this um, hellscape. I will say, as a minor note, <laughs> uh, to continue up with uh, the previous day's discussion, um, I think we'll show Yvonne like mini versions of the. Uh, so what the four tattoos that they know look like. Yeah. Um, which will be in the Discord chat in a second. <laughs> yes, yes, please. Show me and give rough slight mm -hmm. descriptions so people can. Just, just a side, you know, thing. Um one is basically the, yeah, I'm pointing from the floor just while mine now. Um one is obviously the one that uh you know Pink Drop has now, which is the linking tattoo. It's like sort of a cross uh like like almost like a boomerang shape on sideways in a cross. Uh, then you have the Troublemaker Tattoo, which is like an inky tail on the back, or at least that's where it would be explained. Yep. The Unlocking Tattoo is basically like one that goes on the foot slash leg, and sort of looks like a keyhole with like a ankle bracelet, I guess you'd almost call it. And then uh, the Gentle Path, I forget what that sort of art is called, but it's basically like a lot of crossover thing, cross stitch, I'd almost call it like, almost looks like armor on the chest. Yeah, yeah, like a weave. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, she she looks at this. She's intrigued by just the the idea of the design, and like when if you just like sort of describe what they do as well, she's mm -hmm. very much like interested. Um, I can see these working with a lot of people. Yeah, this these might. This could be very helpful. Uh, how does this sort of thing work, though, for us, particularly? If, if we were to try to even use it. Um, well, I'm not the most experienced. I even got mine from someone else originally. Uh, it's basically I do out the design and then I utilize my tattooist tools by... It's like magic. Um, 
basically the design gets put up, the magic gets imbued, and uh, it sort of gets transferred onto your skin, at which point you can attune to it. You can unattune, but it's just a regular tattoo at that point. I see. Um, and different inks, uh, well, I don't have different inks on me at the moment, just a basic one. Uh, only enough for two currently. Yeah. And if, if we go for any tattoos that are rare in the future, we may have to find uh, things to mix with them to help imbue the magic. Like some rare creatures or moss okay. flowers, you know. Well, at least most of the fauna should be easy enough. All the flora. The creatures. That one will be a bit more of an unknown. Mm -hmm. We don't know what we're running ourselves into, but I don't think anything undead will be helpful. <laughs> From stories I've heard, there are tattoos that could use that. Okay. There's even legends out there of full body things that deities even grant sometimes. Interesting. But yes, um. I yeah, just sort of ponders for a moment. Like I could be able to buy one of these. She's like a little bit hesitant, but like she's interested in like there is at least I feel like from you particularly there there hasn't been a kind of deceptive nature at all. Personally, that I find mm. so she's. She's more kind of willing to give it a go, but definitely hesitant. Still. All I would ask in return is if you know any magic that I could maybe learn, uh, cast it sometime if we have the spare energy. I can probably do that. That doesn't seem too difficult for me. After we even take. Um, like short breaks, I can usually regain my stamina in a way where my magic is mostly tied to that. Mm -hmm. So I could, if you need, I just need to know what. I imagine that would just be a conversation. Oh, the sort of yep, thing, just like continue, be. continue on, like oh, you know, like the whole sort of continuing the conversation of what can you learn, like. Yeah. Like, Ink would probably just go off and s uh, explain spells they know, and maybe go on a little about how they learnt them. Uh, not not explaining very much on how they learnt to time hop, but that one's not important. Yeah, no, I mean, <laughs> she doesn't question like when stuff is like omitted and even obviously omitted. Avon doesn't question it. There is always that kind of look of just listening, taking in the information. But, like, her, her stance on a lot of things doesn't really change often. It's still kind of... She's looking around, she's paying attention, she's trying to understand what's happening around her. Have we bought enough time for Mochi to come back? <laughs> no, never. He's not allowed back. Someone just wants to roll their survivals to prepare? Sure, yeah, they can, they can roll some to prepare, yeah. Yay! That's a stealth. It's alright, my mouth's being really screwy. <laughs> that is stealth. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> stealth. <laughs> stealth at first accident. Stealth. What do oh, yeah. you uh, do on the road, Cinta, like while we're moving? Ah, uh, well, she's definitely carrying trips if, uh, down for it. And she just kind of idly chats with uh, Ivy or Dritz and just kind of looks around for things. If there's pretty flowers in like quick arms reach, she will grab them and shove them in her bag. Mm. You probably 
don't need a check or anything like that. But like in those chats, like you do notice that when like you might like pull away to go do something, it's almost like that kind of like slight tug back just to kind of keep uh, the conversation going just that little bit longer, like before you move on. Like just those those small things that you probably might see just in someone that's like trying to just get your attention just a little bit more. Yeah. But that's that's probably what I imagine just happened. There's been happening, especially like the past few days. Uh, yeah. Maybe yes. Ink asked how how did you two meet. I think Avon's the first Into to speak. Looks at yeah. Avon with like a, a look of uh, how do we say this? Avon is definitely the first to speak on that. Um, like as it just looks to her. But I'm trying to think how she would word it. <laughs> Thanks, AJ. Well, we just happened to meet in um, a similar place where we kind of ended up. I would say growing up together. Kind of grew hmm. up. And it was one of those places where it was a bit more, I guess, strict in what they did. Like, they kind of had different groups that people would interact with. We just so happened to, uh, at one point, be in the same uh, group together and were learning what we were learning at the time together. Hmm. While what we were doing was a bit separated from each other in terms of, you know, proper communication, in those downtimes we just would talk. And then just, there was a point where we just, we didn't like what we were doing, um, and we just wanted to leave and do our own thing. Instead of what we were being told to do. Ink, understand. Yep. What's your passive insight? What's your passive, passive insight? insight? Just curiosity. Uh, I have a plus two, so twelve. Twelve. Uh, what's my? I need to look at my passives. <laughs> I'd say with a twelve meets it uh you kind of pick up like the slightest hint that like there's a bit of not nervousness but like that kind of uh fidgeting as she's like sort of saying these things like it's kind of like there is eye contact she's probably saying it um no hint of anything else it's just yeah that slight little tick whether it be personality based or whatever, you're not quite sure. As thank you. Ink's real name start with N. Session by session, we'll get all the letters. <laughs> Starts yeah. with N. Mm -hmm. Say in... wild's dangerous. Say don't give name often. I want to say that's probably something that I might have learnt uh, where we were, and like before you even continue like pr properly explaining into it, like it's just that kind of nod of like, I believe I actually this was something that I remember learning that the Fae themselves power from it, if I remember. <laughs> power can be tied to. A name and that power I know can can be strong and so it's understandable but in that same regard in case it might have been showing please note that the hesitation does come a bit from that as well if you say you are very wild it is hard to understand what fool 
trickery might come from that. Pink sort of woke up in um, human realm. But you are fake, correct? Mm, sort of. Ink does not have those name powers some fey have. Ink just understands tradition. I want to make an insight check on that, just to be certain. <laughs> As is the nature of the one. <laughs> well, I'm even going to roll persuasion. <laughs> you can tell me what a five gives me. It's about as well as I'm explaining it. Um, yeah, it's a, yeah, okay. Yeah, Ink's like... They're not lying, necessarily, it, but it, it's hard to pick up exactly. Yeah, it's hard to know it. what's wrong with that. Like, yeah, there, actively, there might be something. When they're trying to speak common, it's actively a lot harder to pick up. Yes. What they're trying to, if, if they're being honest, yes. I guess. I get that. Yeah, it's almost like you get given the full sentence. You know that something's wrong with what was said, but you can't identify the specific word or the specific part. Like, yeah, no, she just sort of takes that. She nods along with, like, some sort of, like, creative, like, believing. But, uh, again, like, that, that similar hesitation when you were chatting before about the tattoo is there, like, in that aspect. She doesn't continue the conversation because she's a little bit worried, but... Um... Yeah. Ink thinks you two are... Uh... Gorgeous together. <laughs> and immediately upon that, the... the worry turns to a little bit of shyness. <laughs> like... Probably a fair I, bit. I don't like these rolls in the background. <laughs> don't worry about it. Just let it happen. Just let it happen. Let him roll. He's enjoying it. Yeah. yeah. Just, just like a fair bit of shyness. Just all of a sudden. Curious if Cinta like... has any reaction to that. Cinta just does like a little giggle. Just lets the conversation stay mainly between you two. <laughs> See, he is like kind of like have that little shy feature as well as they sort of go down a little bit. <laughs> Trying to cover. <laughs> Um, thank, thank you. Um, anyway, I probably should go back to helping Mochi with the path. Mm, and she mm. just, like, like, just <laughs> tries to immediately exit. <laughs> Ink will bite Blossom's ear. What? <laughs> oh. I'm so Sure. Is that verbal or is that action? <laughs> you know what? I'm leaving that up to interpretation as we return back to uh, no, that, Mochi and you. Is that a, yeah. Uh, no, I, I need to know if that was. was. Yeah, I need to know if that was a verbal thing or a thing you did. Who knows? <laughs> I need to know. Nah. Mochi, uh, what are we doing? Fast or slow today, or normal? We're just now gonna it's... do normal. Alright. No, but now uh, some cost. <laughs> just roll flat then. Roll is he, flat. You see, Jeremy, now it's some cost. We have to, like, keep going fast. <laughs> I don't think you wanted me to. No. Okay. <laughs> These are all so scary. Are as you guys uh, continue to walk, um, you all start traveling once again. Uh, Mochi seemingly unable to track where he's going for a second day in a row. Um, as you all stop in the morning, there doesn't seem to be anything that's happening. Um, if he see, if he seems like he's still like unsure exactly where we're heading. Uh, I want to try to help to like identify the path that we took. Yeah, go again. Roll a, uh, roll a investigate uh, a survival. survival. Yeah. Fifteen. Fifteen. Yeah, you can tell that you're going north once more. If I'm able to catch that slightly earlier, I will just tell him to stop. <laughs> We're still heading wrong. We're getting turned around somewhere through these trees. 
they all start to look the same after a while. They taste the same too. We can take a swap if needed. We don't have to do it all the time. Yeah, alright. We'll do that then. As... And yeah, I'll try to I'll try to readjust, but I imagine like that doesn't change the tile world. Yeah. <laughs> as you plan to switch the next day as well, and as Yvonne takes the lead, you're you move into different paths, and there doesn't seem to be anything during the middle of the afternoon. Um, but again, once as you're heading into uh, heading south once more from this tile. Uh, you notice probably up in front of you, maybe 60, 70 feet, uh, there seems to be uh, a group of five, uh, a group of six people and two skeletons uh, walking together. Um, right. But notably, one of the people is fully dressed in red. With a large wizard's hat. And I immediately run. And that's where we'll uh, end session for the day. <laughs> run like away or towards? Gra gra grab his hand and turn. That's a red wizard of Thay. Aww, oh, yeah, that was, that's what I was afraid of. And uh, yeah, we'll call it there for the evening, I think. Well, I'm glad someone else said something first, because I was going to say, oh, maybe we can talk to her. <laughs> You want to talk to the red wizards? No, I want to talk to the <laughs> dude that has the skeletons and they're still fine. Uh... Hello there, good sir. We appear to be lost. Could you give us a couple directions? Yeah, that was session. Okay, but hear me out. I could learn magic from them. <laughs> <laughs> right? That magic might be a little too strong for you. Doesn't mean I can't learn it. <laughs> As a, yeah. Here's the, um, the funny thing, which I don't mind saying, uh, I can technically learn night, night level magic if I roll high enough. I just can't use it till I'd have that available. Uh, okay, so you can, like, yeah, you can jot it down. You just mm -hmm. can't, yeah, use it. But yeah, how's our... I've got a, a new plugin for our friendos to plug their streams. So what have our what have our friendos streams like lately? Uh, I did some seven days start streaming yesterday. Yeah. Uh, still looking into starting a zomboid run up with Sam. Uh, also talks of maybe a Stardew Valley hundred percent run with Sam. Mm hmm. I've just been busy with work. Sorry. Yeah, no, it's totally fair. Man. Take your time. Uh, otherwise, uh. Setting up Pokemon Nuzlocke for Pokemon Y with uh, Jeremy. Nice, nice. And just at the moment hoping to do another stream on Friday probably. Mm. Nice. Um, I believe it's just been a common thing of Brosia happening the opposite weeks of this week. So we're doing it again next week. We're doing a Brosia next week. Gonna, gonna go fight the bandits and maybe find find a Sam. We we still have yet to find one. We don't know. Don't where worry, it is. the art's coming. Oh no, just gotta just gotta find the Sam. Just gotta find the Sam. Apart from that, everything's going good. So next next Saturday. I don't have it. Fair enough. She streams <laughs> on our stream. Sam? I guess, yeah, we got Terraria going. Um, we figured out how to beat the Wall of Flesh finally, and it turns out I'm just a fucking dumbass. It, it's actually really easy. I'm just stupid. <laughs> I was going to question that a little. Like, don't you just build a really big platform and run? <laughs> uh... Yeah, it turns out um, in Get Fixed Boy, it's it's so it constantly spawns imps. Okay. Yeah. And you can't destroy their fireballs. Oh. So you basically have to do a level of Toho while fighting the Wall of Flesh. Um, on top of that, you can't use the Star Cannon either until you've beaten it once because the Star Cannon just bounces off it. 
don't know. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's going great. It's going to be so great. Um, and yeah, what Mim said before, we are going to be looking into doing that stuff. Um, otherwise. I'm going to be returning to YouTube once Stardew Valley gets its update on March 16th. Nice. I just want to do Yay. some multi-streams. Just never yeah. do. Um, on my end, uh, it looks like we've got about... Uh, we get another week of streams not being interrupted, so Tuesday is going to be whatever you guys decide. Uh, I finished Hi-Fi Rush to the best of my ability, and by the best of my ability, I'm like just playing the game. Uh, and there's a current vote going up with choices for you to pick, such as Octopath Traveler, Devil May Cry, Sky and Sky, Ori and the Will of the Wisps, The Great Ace Attorney Chronicles, and Heartbound. So if you want to decide my fate and make me not play Octopath Traveler for like the fifth time in a row, you have the ability <laughs> to do so. You can join my Discord. <laughs> um, Wednesday's more Digimon World. I've been enjoying that. Uh, we made a lot. We've made a lot more progress this time than we did last time, and I've got current goals to achieve, and I know what I need to do. So that's fun. Thursday, if everything goes well, another randomized race. Uh, we are entering, I guess, the mid game. <laughs> Maybe the pre late game. I guess you call it. Um, I'm at gym number eight. These two are also at gym number eight, but I guess, a little yeah, section before me. Um, they gotta yeah. go save the radio tower, I gotta go train to beat Claire up. And then, yeah, we'll be looking into beating the Elite Four, round one, and then... Going to Kanto, I guess. Uh, Friday is gonna be more Yakuza 3. I spent the entire stream yesterday doing sub-stories and stuff, and we only just got into Chapter 5. Uh, so, hopefully you watch me do that again, because that's what I always do. I just do all the sub-stories I can, and then we can make progress. <laughs> Um, so chapter five of Yakuza three next Friday, and if everything's going all good by Saturday, uh, you can join me and K as we play Celeste. Where K plays Celeste, and I, the, I play Celeste. You do play maybe a hundred percent. Who knows? I go for the hard stuff while he's a little bit behind, so I can struggle with pain. Just got a very appropriate role for D and D related things on this cards generator. <laughs> And uh, yeah, we'll see you all. If not the if if they haven't finished my room and it's not done by the sixteenth of um, March, then that sucks. But we'll see you on the for the thirtieth for our potential final uh, stream of this hiatus as we we'll go into Broad maybe, uh, or we continue into April, and then May we'll be back up with our regular schedule of. Uh, Echoes and Guardians uh, at least if nothing changes in the two months that takes <laughs> so but yeah mm -hmm. thanks for hanging out uh, we'll see you all well I'll see you all Tuesday then bye bye bye, bye. 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 bye.